I swear to God, I have my notebook today. I'm gonna make notes today. Um. Uh. We didn't get to gamble any, but we did find out that Wedge was considered or could be gambled with. Yeah. And he's fucking unconscious because he's dumb. Although I think you guys chose to bring him in as a pet. I think so. I, will I can still gamble it if I wanted to, though. I, I will say that last scene with Wedge was probably my favorite scene of this entire campaign. Yeah. <laughs> it, it was absolutely great to me that I was just like, so he's gonna... I just... It was almost like proof that you can't get away from the story. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, obviously you can. It obviously... You know, you, he you know, he has in ways, but uh, it's just so funny to think like you can't get the fuck away from me. <laughs> <laughs> just, just ASMR There's that no shit. You can go. You can't fucking escape me anymore. You son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> As he's being dragged in chains to the casino, basically. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, he's gotten a nice hoverboard ride. Yeah. And probably internal bleeding. But that's where the blood's supposed to be. I mean, technically? Yeah, you can't look me in the eye and tell me I'm wrong. No. No, I can't. For many reasons. Because I won't look anyone in the eye. I'm afraid of human contact. No. I'm deeply ashamed in my body, so I don't look anybody in the eye. It's getting too real in here. We gotta go back to the the funny comedic jokes. Michael, say something okay. stupid. Nah, I'm good. Good job. Thank you. Nice. 10 out of 10. Your check's in the mail. <laughs> so easy to set up. Just like... <laughs> there was no response Literally there. Literally everything you would say. Uh, I wonder if you guys are ever going to get Wedge's consciousness back. Maybe, maybe, I don't, maybe, I don't know. Maybe he can gamble his life back. Maybe he can gamble his way out of the casino. Maybe he's gamble his way into a fight. Gamble my way into a fight? I'll just get into a fight. Why would you get into a fight and not get any, like, gambling rewards? Because fuck gambling. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, put him on the I'm wheel. <laughs> put him on the it's table. We, we need a double up here. Put him on the table. Bet, bet on black. We'll buy a better wedge. And this is where we're all going to learn that I've never been to a casino and the only gambling I've done was with my grandpa in his basement. To be fair, no matter how much gambling you've done, the house always wins. Oh, yeah. But I just don't know how gambling works. I mean, it depends on what the game is. You got roulette, you got craps, you got some old schooly, old school games that I included from medieval times. I'm thorough. Oh, medieval times. <laughs> yeah, those ones are a little bit crazy. I'm a fan. Listen, listen, gambling is Carly's only vice. If Wedge ever wants to wake up, maybe he can stop her from gambling. Maybe. Just pick her up and throw her. Yup. <laughs> First thing, we gamble for new clothes.
So, uh, anybody watch any good documentaries lately? <laughs> Every time. Um, last documentary I watched was How to Catch or Don't Don't Fuck with Cats: How to Catch an Internet Killer. Fun. Yeah. yeah. No, I'm just kidding. The last documentary I watched was a series called Our Planet, I think. Very nice. I mean, I liked gay, it a lot. which is also very nice. Yeah. Yeah. Because I'm gay. Yeah. It also means happy. I saw a cross stitch the other day that said, that said, I'm not queer as in, or wait. Oh, what did it say? I'm gonna look it up. Hold on. This will take a minute to find what I'm looking for. Yay. Not. Death is coming, eat trash, be free. Oh God. My only question is, what game are we playing first? I think the first one is trying to get into the casino. I mean, I think you guys are at the casino. I thought you were taking the tour. Yeah, we're getting there. We're taking the tour, but uh, Jewel almost got us thrown overboard. I mean, to be fair, it's, it's the same thing Michael does all the time. Yeah. I was just unconscious, so I couldn't do it this time. Was, Not this time. He was still trying. He just... Mike. Mike, shame, shame, shame. Found it. Not gay as in I empathize with the plight of the X-Men, but queer as in Magneto was right. Apt. Yeah. To be fair, Magneto was right. Yeah, he was. You know who else was right? Doom! I know less about that franchise. Yeah, it's fine. It's it's actually the Doom from Marvel. Ah. Because the dude from Doom is is actually the Slayer. I just learned mm. that.
Wait, Jules, she's like here, right? But she's not like here. Yeah. Hmm. I think. Some someone whisper, Jewel. Jewel. I said whisper, not haunt at her. Oh Jesus Christ! Now what? Haunt. <laughs> well, that's all I do. I'm also a ghost. Hi. I'm the most interesting dead person in the world. No, not really. Not really. I've just fooled you all into thinking I was normal. Uh, you did not do a good job. No, I didn't. I failed in my one job. Well, don't quit your day job, but quit that job. <laughs> it's like... Oh my god. <sighs> I'm taking half of Friday and then all of Monday off of work. I'm getting a four-day weekend. Very nice. Yeah. Oh. Because I'm about six inches from a mental breakdown. It would take a light gust of wind to blow me off course and into a mental breakdown or into a mental hospital. Yeah, I was gonna make a joke about six inches, but then you, you know, all the mental breakdown stuff killed it. Yeah. Killed my yeah. joke. It was also gay, so that kind of kills it too. Nah, nah, that doesn't kill it for me. <laughs> dildo. <laughs> also, dildo. Nope. You are talking to the guy who is, uh. I'm, I guess I'm not. Uh, bisexual, but I, I mean. <laughs> Twenty dollars is twenty dollars. Are you pan? Kinda. Nice. I guess I've just never really found any guys worth being attracted to. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I thought too, until I was like, you know what? I think I'm just gay. Yeah, the problem is I definitely like women. <laughs> yeah. See the thing is I do too. And that's when I knew I was gay. See, and that's why I still like... That's the thing. I never get to meet any guys I think are actually attractive. Like, I don't know, like, uh, fucking Johnny Depp or something. Really? But, you mean like Johnny Depp in the Pirates of the Caribbean, not like Johnny Depp now, right? I mean, I don't know what he looks like now. I have zero. Not great. That sucks. Not great. Being in a bad relationship will do that to you. Yeah. Johnny should get with me. Mm-hmm. You treat him right. No, but still. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I'm just fucking around, obviously, but... Can I also say, by the way, as we make fun of the current looks of people, um, okay, well, maybe now he doesn't actually look that bad. He got over whatever happened to him. It was his relationship. Yeah. He looks, he looks a little better now. That's good. So I, I, I'll give it to you. But, but yeah, I obviously did mean that Johnny Depp, though. Yeah, yeah. The, um, the, um, I have to do interviews and shit for work, right? Mm -hmm. And we interviewed this one guy named Robert. And I look at him in our Zoom meeting because we're all digital. We can't interview in person yet. Mm -hmm. And I look at him and I'm like, oh my god, is this guy an undercover cop? Because you look at him and he's got this like square jaw, right? And you can tell he's like holding his shoulders back enough to kind of push out his chest. And he's got this regulation haircut, right? And I'm like, you look like an undercover cop. I don't want to hire you. <laughs> a cab. My man, a cab. Grow your hair out. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I'm so behind the times. I don't even know what a cab means. All cops are bastards. I was gonna. My first guess was all cops are bad, but I mean, 
you know. I mean, that works too. Mom, why are you knocking on my door? Sure, yes, please. You're talking shit about the police. Um, just a cheeseburger. Yeah, just the one. Love you, bye. Sorry about that. But yeah, a cab means all cops are bastards. Gotcha. The sad thing is it's not true, but might as well No, be. it's not true. It's not. It's like me saying all straight men are bad. Of course it's not true. But the ones who take offense to the st saying all straight men are bad are the straight men we're talking about. Most of the you time. Because I don't, like, when they're yeah. like, all straight men suck, it's like, well, the person saying not this. Not all. <laughs> and even beyond that, I'm just like, the person saying this obviously has some issues if they're willing to categorize a group of people into a, into a large, you know, section of society like you know that's, oh, not, yeah. that's dumb as a scientist that's dumb and scientists love mm -hmm. to categorize stuff mm -hmm. but that's dumb yeah i say it a lot though because the straights said it about me for a long time so i'm gonna say it back fuck you straights <laughs> no offense no full offense if you take offense good there you go Never apologize for being an angry bastard. Exactly. I'm a I'm an angry I'm an angry bold Ike and you're not gonna change my mind. None of you can say that word. Which one, bull? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How dare you say that word in my presence? How else am I That's supposed to cut people? <laughs> You explain to me how that works. What, what word do I use now? Moose? Yeah. Have you seen a moose? No, and I pray never to. Yeah, they're like a million feet tall. They're prehistoric monsters. And one of their, uh, um, one of the ones, that, one of the animals that hunt moose is an orca whale because they dive 20 feet underwater. Imagine being the scuba diver finding that shit out. Water moose. <laughs> Fucking 20 feet underwater, my man. It's funnier if you're like running to the water to escape it and you're just like, I'm so safe. And then you turn around and it's just dolphining towards you. <laughs> <laughs> you're right, that's funnier. It's just. Oh my god, do 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 do. Nowhere is safe. I'm just gonna let it kill me. Oh jeez. And it will, six. with no compunction. It will kill you. I mean, most most animals will with no real fucks given. Yeah, most herbivores especially. Herbivores are fucking monsters. Look, you don't stay eating grass by not beating the shit out of people. Exactly. Have you have you met an angry vegan? God no, and I hope you never. <laughs> I did once. I think. Oh God! Wait a minute! Wait a minute. What the heck did I, I walk still myself? have the just... salad scars. Oh God! I'm so glad you survived. They hit me with Do so much soy. I thought I would never see meat again. What did I walk myself into? Uh, a description of why or why uh, herbivores are monsters evil like an herbivore yeah. will just straight attack you no reason hates you like I saw, a, I saw a hippopotamus like I know they're omnivores but whatever um I saw a hippopotamus fucking a team of hippotam hippopotami fucking destroy a crocodile yeah they only needed one but they they run like a gang mm -hmm. they were like what are you doing in our side of the river punk yeah, like you stand between it. My my anthropologist, he's anthropology teacher, taught it, or went to Africa a bunch of times, right? Because you know she's in a fucking anthropologist, and she studies monkeys and shit. So that's where she goes where monkeys go. Um, and so she was in Africa a bunch of times, right? And she told us this story that um, her, I mean, not the time she almost got eaten by a cheetah, um, but the time was it a cheetah? It was some kind of big cat. Uh, it was about the time she. Um, um, she tried to park a jeep, right, 
Um, but the but the guide guy who was there with her yelled at her because she parked it like beside the water, and that's how you get got in fucking hippo land. Yeah, real easy to do. Don't make it easy. It's like don't make it behind the water. Damn it. I mean, they're pretty fast on land too. Yeah, but like you stand between a hippo and the water, you're gonna die. Like, say goodbye to your prayers and say goodbye to your butthole because both of them will be gone. <coughs> yeah. So, what we're hearing is chaos. <laughs> lots and lots of freaking chaos. Well, yeah. we had to do something while you were gone. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm, I'm aware. Hey, like I said. And when the, <coughs> when the mother is gone, the children will play. Oh, dear gosh. At least our no. boy is here now. Yeah. How long did it take? Because I know I went, it was a while for that salad. Uh, less than an hour. Like, yeah. But I also don't see... Uh, see for, you know, the... I'm in logged in. Oh, yeah, I do have to get out my computer, don't I? I was so excited I got my notebook. I left my computer in my desk. Hold on. <laughs> Someone slow clap. Michael, go. Good job. <laughs> Yikes. That clap was so slow. Nah, you didn't even see it. It gets slower. He's copying my slap. Nice. Yeah, it's the best. Mm -hmm. I have a question. It's not that yet. Okay, I, I'll wait. Now I'm done. Okay. I have a question. <coughs> yeah. Could we try to... You know how our call time used, was at 6? I don't well, know about your time or my time, but yeah. My time. Um, What if we make that the start time for next week? I mean... I can make it. I'm usually pretty good by then. I We pushed back till 5 because no one was showing up at the 4 call time. Well, mm. I guess 6 call time your time. 4 call time my time. Well, I wouldn't be able to show up at the call time, but I would be able to be there at 5. Or at 6, I mean. My time. 6 my time. Yeah. That's just when... Because, the, just because... That's, sorry? That's when call and start used to go was 4 to 4.30, but... Then we we kept showing up later and later. To be fair, I haven't. Uh, it wasn't my fault entirely. <laughs> entirely. I'm just old, so that's accurate. Mike, the way, Michael's the always way having it. dinner Isn't at that five. Accurate? <laughs> <laughs> this is on stream <laughs> too. This is on stream too. That's so funny. <laughs> I was fully about to go on with whatever I was saying, and then I just processed what Jula just said to me to my face. <laughs> I literally got it here. <laughs> anyway, I yeah, believe she... I said it. At least it was Jewel. straight. At least it was straight to your face. Mm. Mm -hmm. and, only, and the only thing is, I agree with what you're just putting out on this instance. Mm hmm. <laughs> I mean, if the bard says it's true, if the bard says it's true. <laughs> I'm dying. I'm gonna fight her. We haven't even I'm started playing and I'm dying. Anyway, <laughs> the way the way I figure it is that I'm an old person, Jewel, shut up. Um, I'm an old person. If we start <laughs> Then you're putting yourself in there. You're putting yourself right in there. <laughs> if we start at <laughs> my time, and then we end at ten o'clock my time, that's four hours. We still get to play. Once again, I'm fine with it. You just got to get everybody else to show up on time. Michael yeah, always you... eating dinner. I like I said, you put yourself in that predicament, Miss Bard. You have put yourself in quite a predicament. I play a bard. I am nowhere near as clever. I mean, you did put yourself in that box like that, and I would call that clever. I did, I did kind of box myself in there, huh? Hashtag yeah. Boxed in. 
Yeah, I mean, if the, and I'm always, I'll, I mean, most of the time I do end up playing a mage out of nine out of whatever. So, what the heck do you want me to do? I mean, the, a few sub exceptions are the paladins, in which turns out to be the nicest sun, uh, array of sunshine. But, like, can we move the start time, though, Jewel? Is that okay? Can you guys do that? Can we can can we try? I mean, I'm sitting here eating a satellite. Eating a satellite? I said salad. Oh, listen, I couldn't. I can't hear. I'm old. Remember? Sure. You keep putting yourself in this box. <laughs> Understand that you keep putting yourself in this lovely little box. I will never understand it, and I will constantly be and not be sad about it that you called me old. You put you oh, wait a minute. You said it, and it ever to a degree is factually right. Everyone did. Someone who died. Michael, Good where's idea. the popcorn? <laughs> uh, no, he doesn't want to get the popcorn, so I'll have to go do it. And even then, I think it's more of self-roasting less than, you know, actual. I would totally get s'mores, but I can't. Anyway, you guys, is that something we can do, both both Jewel and, and Michael? You're saying this like, how often am I late? Every single day. Sure I am. What time did we start today because of you, Jewel? Jewel regard? Gem in my sky? Hun, who's the one that was last to arrive? I at least said I was gonna go get something to eat. Mm-hmm. Oh, don't get me, me, me. Listen, though. Can we do that, though? Like, yeah, no? I mean... You're, we haven't heard anything from our very lovely AU DM, but that's... I said yes right away. No, I said AU! Oh, yeah, after hours, yeah. Yeah. I think he's taking Adam. care of a baby. <gasps> hey, Ooh. Okay, okay. So you know how we normally call him the AU DM? Mm -hmm. What if we do go with after hours DM because then he'd be Autumn. Autumn. Mm -hmm. Autumn. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I dig it. I dig it. Yeah, I dig it too. That's why I'm just like, I'm not with it. <laughs> We're no good. See, see. And, and then again, I play mages with you guys, or straight up something that I can actually defend my thyself from chaos. And then I play a paladin that's full of shit. <laughs> so, I'm either bucks a bozo fun or just agitating to deal with, according to our lovely Autumn DM. Autumn! Autumn. That things that tried to hit a small maze is a pain in the ass. <laughs> <laughs> and what you do? I mean, I could easily change that. Don't you freaking dare do it. We we decided you're now instead of the alternate universe DM, you're the after hours DM, so you can be the autumn. I know. I was here for that entire conversation. Yeah. You can speak? How dare you? I know, right? See, this is what I mean. He he just no no he doesn't want to speak when when he, his input is very much needed. Well, anyway, Michael, is that something we can swing, or do you want to keep it at the same time? I don't give a shit. That's his answer. Alright. I actually yeah. could have told you that was going to be answer. I could have. But they seemed, they seemed pretty intent on talking among themselves, so I was happy to just listen and eat my popcorn. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I mean, I mean, we sat here and having a, a pretty much 
So, what we've come to agree is Wedge in Florence versus Wedge in Florence. Second round is pretty much Sarah Show versus freaking. <laughs> Listen, right now, right now, in, in, in our current world, right, in our current game, it is fucking, it's fucking Carly versus Florence 100% of the time. Yeah, but uh, to be fair, you self made this problem. Nah, 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 nah. Yeah, yeah. Who goes up to a door that's previously known to cause damage, touch the that's door- That's the alternate and... universe that does not count here. And then the fact that in this version... Do we need to talk about that in a context sense? No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yep. No. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> So hopefully, hopefully next week we can start at six o'clock my time. Wait. So just like an hour earlier, and like an hour earlier from the previous start time, not an hour earlier from when you guys actually show up. Honey, I'm not guilty here. <laughs> Everybody's I guilty. Freaking... I went to go get a stamp salad and stop dealing. Literally, with... literally everyone is guilty. I was ten minutes late myself. See. I was here, but I don't hop in call until people start getting here, so... Mostly because I have audio mm. stuff going on the side. But I check up on you guys most of the time. Having said that, I have been late before, so... That's yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, and I'm... Yeah, and plus I was watching some game footage for Baller's Gate. Slow claps. Dude, I heard a lot about that today, because that is the second time I heard that, that game mentioned today. Yeah, no. Today. Yeah. Oh, oh! Well, that's probably why I heard it. Yeah. 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 That's yeah, the one. It's... Yeah, I was watching. So, uh, anyway, now that we have next week resolved, are we ready to start on this week? Yeah. 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 I, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm feeling freaking dumb with it right now. I mean, uh, with this, because good reasons, good freaking reasons. That as well as. We, uh, like I said, the other paladin I play as. We found the good book. <laughs> the good book. The hold good on, book? Hold on, I gotta get my notebook. The good book! My notebook is now never my good really book. liked that book. That's full plot. You holes. know what good book I'm talking about. Axel knows what good book I'm talking about. It's obviously my notebook, because I'm no, taking notes. No, 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 no. Axel knows what good book I'm talking about. I'm not spoiling this good book. Didn't do it, wasn't me. <laughs> we found the good book, and then we found the um, not so great book. Yeah. He's, he's just like I can't read. It's not my fault. No. Look, no reading I, isn't is not a problem. It's an impossibility. Do I? I will freaking listen, listen. listen though. I've got my notebook. I'm gonna take notes this time. Good. Very good. We're. In Biotopia, in the casino <laughs> that's yeet. surrounded by a kraken. Also, yeet. That's named Carlos. His name is Carlos. That is his name. By yeah. Carlos the, the kraken. kraken. <laughs> he speaks Spanish kraken, by the way. Good. He speaks Spanish kraken? Spanish. Spanish kraken. Who yeah. speaks... Yeet. Spanish Kraken. Ole. Indeed. Nice. Who speaks Spanish Kraken in the land of Vitopia? So I'm going to send Axel what book I am talking about. Our friends are Michael. Matthew? Matthew? Matthew. Matthew. Matthew and Jameson. That was a good book. Still well, can't read, though. The Gay I... Gnomes. <laughs> you know what books I'm... I sent you. I know, I know the, the books. Gay but... Yeah, yeah. I just didn't want to spoil the fun bits. After, yeah, that, that, that was my happy little moment of enjoying that. And I get to keep the good book. 
because apparently no one wanted them. People sometimes don't want things. I mean, the wizard took the bad and uh, not so great book, but then that leaves me with the good book. Our friends are Matthew and Jameson, the gay gnome pimps. Well, one's a gnome pimp. What's the other one? He works at a casino. Technically, they yeah. both do, but one works for the casino, one works at the casino. Oh. So, one's no the gay pimp and casino worker. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I like keeping my notes accurate. It's a good thing to have. Mm -hmm. Probably got better notes than me already. Nice. I mean, I remember his name now, so that's probably good. But yeah, there's your answer to that shorter answer. Yeah, 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 yeah. But now we are we are in our current week of game. Mm -hmm. No, 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 on no. Ten seven twenty twenty. Yeah. I mean, my character's unconscious. I'm just waiting for you all to do your shit. Yeah, or this is why you... Yeah, yeah. You can't heal me nothing. Yeah, exactly. I can't do anything. I can't heal. I'm in the freaking wizard. What the heck do you expect me to do? We could take a nap. Yeah, he looks at you he's like, no. No, no, okay. sl no sleeping here. Well, not, okay. not for, uh... Travelers who aren't staying more than a day. We want you down there gambling. Plus, you do gotta go and gamble. I forget how much was it? Shit. Um, out of character, I have. Uh, where is gold? I have 93 gold. And Florence has about 52 gold pieces. So we need to make up the rest of it. That's right, because you have to pull in the other exit fee because you paid for the entrance fee. And for Michael's entrance fee, so he is technically not... Uh... <laughs> We're talking about the damn fucking finch. <laughs> sorry, sorry. It's all finch. Good. It's a finch. So how much do we need? I, be I believe you should need, uh, it was, oh god. I'm gonna say like 100 gold. Is what yeah, needed. you needed 100 gold each though. Yeah. And then remember you have to pay a percentage of whatever you win or lose on the way out, so you actually need more than 100 gold to leave. Yeah, cause if I remember correctly, in total it's 200 for each. Yeah, but that was to hop on. Yeah, and not 200 each. I mean, 200. Yeah, it was 100 yeah. each. 100 each. And then 100 on the way out. For the so total 200. 200. It was 200 in total. And since Wedge is counted as our luggage. He only counted as... Oh, wait, I thought you took him as a pet. Something along the way. Yeah, well, because the luggage is, like, gambleable, and so that's free. But a pet costs 50, so I thought you guys had paid that 50 for Wedge as well. Yeah, there's that too, because it was two fifty. Yeah, right. It was two fifty. It was two fifty. I was wondering where the hell did I get two fifty from, and then they, it broke down, and I yep. had slowly. It just needed See? time to remember. That's why we gotta take notes. Anyway. Oh no 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 no! I mean, like I said, I said I told you. Got the remembrance just of the notes. notes. Just took notes. But uh. We need a hundred gold each to come in. Fifteen percent of whatever we win to leave. Fifty for pet price and a hundred each to leave. And Ursula gets to stay free because or, uh, Florence. It's because that's Florence. Yeah, summons can be pushed into their all dimensions, so they technically don't have to take up space. Exactly. They also are not like they don't want you to use your summon to cheat, basically. Oh, who said I was the one to do it? I was even thinking of just doing. I, and I do think that reminds me of what you guys had asked before we finished last night, which was what's the difference between the cheating side and the non-cheating side. Mm -hmm. And so the only real difference between the cheating side and the non-cheating side is you don't get your hand cut off if you get caught cheating. Oh, also you have to pay a five percent tax on the cheating side. Hmm. See, and this side needs five percent tax. 
let's start with the non-cheating side then. Let me see where this goes. Because I'm trying to see how much this is all be. Let me be realistic here. Wait, don't we need to like log our items? Isn't that what they said we needed to do? Yes. You gotta tell us what you're bringing in so that we know what you can or cannot gamble with. Okay. I can tell you exactly what I'm bringing in. Um, my crossbow. Light. Then. 160 crossbow bolts. <laughs> uh, a dagger. A holy symbol that is on a chain. Holy water in a flask. Do I still have my leather armor or was that gone? That's gone, remember, because anything that was not metal, metal got um, sort of dissolved. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I got a loot. Um, I've got a mirror. I've got oil in a flask. I've got a potion of healing. I've got a ruby worth 5,000 gold pieces. Wait a, minute. Wait a minute. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute. 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 Oh, Florence kind of looks at you and says, "You have a ruby that's worth five thousand. Uh -huh. Where were you holding it? First of all, you that's one. Even... Second of all, that can pay for our fucking trip. It's only worth fifty gold. You just said it was f worth five thousand. I lied the first time. <laughs> The first time, huh? Uh-huh. Florence kind of looks at you like, Could we keep the story straight? <laughs> <laughs> I'm, son of a I'm just dying over here like, ah, oh, shit. Good, good. Listen, 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 you want to go to libraries? I want to go gamble a little bit. Is that such a bad thing to do? Maybe I don't want to pay our fair, uh, or pay, uh, pay our way into, with, into going without gambling. Maybe I want to gamble. You have to gamble anyway. Exactly. Either way, you're gonna have to deal it. Yeah, coming on. But my ruby like is it's, pretty. It's like part of the uh, ride. Like if you don't gamble, it's not. This isn't a bus. Oh, fair. Yeah. So um, my my ruby is worth five thousand gold. What are they gonna do? Chop off a piece? Oh, they'll convert it into another form of material. You could also go to the jewelry gambling area. And if anything, we can pay for the fare, uh, fare, and then we can be left to our own devices without having to worry about the not so bad worst part. I mean, you still have to gamble, but yeah. of course, of course. But we at least don't have to worry about you know two sides of the fee. Okay, here's what we'll do to make sure that Florence is happy with us. Um, I'm not trying to. No, no, no. I'm not trying to be convert... no, no, no. we'll ruby. We'll convert my pretty, pretty ruby into, like, gold pieces or whatever. Yeah. And that won't count towards our winnings, because that would be dumb. But it would be uh, the, at least the fee. Because already we know we are going to need, like, 375. Roughly. Give or take. Well, not really. Because if we have it... Well, it's whatever we win. Here's a here's a question for our tour guide. If it's whatever we win, if we come in with five thousand gold and then lose two thousand gold, but then gain four thousand gold, how so, much are we taxed on? So repeat the equation for me. So if we come in with five thousand gold, we lose two thousand gold, but then we gain four thousand gold. So now we're at six thousand gold. You gained a total of 1,000 gold, you need to pay, I believe it was, what, 25% of that? Something like that? I thought it was 15. 15? Yeah, 15. That sounds about right. All right. So 15, so what's that, 150? Okay. Yeah, that's not bad at all. Okay, so... So, so it's so just whatever we plus, gained. Yes, or lost. So let's say instead right. you just lost 2,000, right? That would have lost you 2,000. So 15% mm -hmm. of that... I don't know. No, I'm, I'm bad at math. 15% of... 15% of 2,000? Yeah. 15% of 2,000. Should it be something like 300? Yeah, 300. Okay, it's just... Okay, okay, okay. 
So this isn't even bad. Yeah. If we come in with a lot of money, we can still leave with a lot of money. Exactly, and that's this and movie. This. this is why I, I was like this movie from the eye of a lich. So it's probably worth even more money now. Yeah, no, no, that's legitimately fair. I mean, I just don't know. I just don't want to know where you were holding that ruby. You don't want to know. She was holding it in her lady pocket. Yeah, it's uh, nature's it? pocket. No, nature's pocket is the butthole. You don't know which one I was hiding it in. Fair. See, I'm not. I ask one of the gnomes to take a whiff of. To a whiff of what? Of the ruby. <laughs> just make, just, just put it on Wedge's face. He doesn't care. Either way, he'll like it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 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 wrong. That's the thing. It's like you want to ask Michael a question, just ask me. I, I know what my internet waifu note wants. <laughs> a little whore. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Uh... <laughs> Okay. I, I made that joke the other day too with Oz, Michael, when I was on the thing, and he's like, "I don't know about this," and I was like, "Look, take it from someone else's internet waifu." <laughs> <laughs> I was waiting. I was like, "If he asks, I'm telling him it's Michael." <laughs> okay. Okay. So this is about doable. This is doable because we have the interest in ex exit fee. Yeah, 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 and here, if you're super duper worried about it, I'll just give you however much we need to actually get off the thingy. So how much is it? Like, here, I'll give you, how about this? How about this? When we get inside, I'll transfer the ruby into 7,000 gold if I make a really good persuasion check. Um, ooh, 8,000 gold if I make a really good persuasion check. Um, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give you uh three thousand gold to hold for me. Okay, this is doable. Cause at least we have the bare minimum and just the only thing we need to keep the tabs on is the win in losses. Mm -hmm. Yeah, see, see, this is a doable thing. This is why uh someone's a brand here. Cause clearly clearly at least we are at least thinking this through. Yeah. So, uh, so, so I turn I, to the, I turn to our tour guide and I say I have this here ruby that is worth at least at least ten thousand gold. I plucked yeah. this. I plucked this right from the eye of a lich, an arc lich to be a demi lich to be more accurate. It wanted to keep it, but I stole it from him right off of his face. Exactly, and I said and, what. And uh, you're doing this to the uh, the guy who's having you bring stuff in, right? Yeah, okay. like yeah. the guy who's like logging all our shit. Yeah, and Flores is helping out, helping with the persuasion. So she's getting advantage on this chaos. Right, right, right. Am I? Am I? Am I? Oh, so that's why you didn't see it, Mister League of Legends. Bullshit! You're playing League. <laughs> well, we, 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 we laugh at him, but I'm cross stitching. That's different than League. I know. That's the there's a difference. Cross stitching and him playing a full blown game that definitely takes thought and concentration. Exactly. You want to make a bet? Uh, I guess he doesn't know how to think or concentrate, so. <laughs> I'm just fucking with you, Michael. See, you, you know I... I love you, Michael. Yeah, I love you too, Axel. Get the fuck off me, bitch! <laughs> I love between two guys. Yeah, okay. Maybe. But yeah, I do that. To, I say that to the guy who's uh, logging in all our shit. Mm -hmm. All righty. So and that guy, uh, that guy's like, "Hey, this is a nice ruby, but uh, I think I can only give you, I can only give you about five thousand. I mean, this is, a de this is a demi lunch's eye. Yeah, think of all the power that this ruby contained. 
Well, it's not yeah, that. It I mean, once... as a, it can be used as a um prophylactory. Yeah. Not only not only that, but also think about it. It can be a gem that you yeah. a yeah. gem ideally use uh, for <laughs> spells. Store spells. No, never mind. Uh, one of those gems that store spells. This is well, this has got to be worth at least at least at least nine thousand gold. And that's a steal. I know, right? I mean, think about it. Mm, that our I, I, I is not up, happy. I can come up to as high as seven. Mm, eight. Seven and a half. Done. Good dealing with you. And, he, and with you, you just hear a ching ding. I know, right? Uh, wait a minute. What did you say yes to, by the way? Seven and a half. So, oh, okay, yeah. That's about two, seven, 750. Yeah. No, God, 7,500. Oh. Oh. Nice. Mm hmm. Okay, I'm, real good at what I do. I'm real good at what I do. Yeah, but also you've gotten me to help you with this chaos, cause trust me. Oh whoop, wrong one. Rain is trying. But yeah, no mm, quietly just gonna look at chat and say, yep, that happened. We just got that. And the review was priced at that much, or was it in exchange for gold? Uh, it's priced at that, so you still just have a ruby, but you can split it if you need to. They do they do that at the, the same table. Which is actually down here, by the way. It is actually right here. Where is it? Right by where you guys are. One okay. second, let me move my character sheet. Oh. And I also have these tools, so that's all my shit. God, I cannot spell today. Oh, I've also got these clothes. Very pretty clothes. Very uh, gorgeous. They are... they're a little dirty. Are you calling me dirty? I mean, well, she can at least... your clothes are, at least. I mean, maybe. And which Florence he's... kind of... Uh, uh, Florence helps fix it up. He just pulls out a... Uh, no, a no, Florence does light. that. Florence does that. <laughs> Pulls out a black light. Oh no, you don't want to do that. <laughs> Florence does that, just like, but the, the now it looks nice. Yes, yeah, so she just patients it. Here's, yeah, here's, now I'm pretty. Here's the question. Hmm? Okay. How much? Yeah, no, it's, yeah, no, no, no. It's a, it's a cubic meter. It should be fine. Yeah. All right. Also, if you go by fan fiction rules, it definitely works for Spunk. We went there. Well, there went there our monetization again. All right, so. Did I do last a while this time? Yeah, that was probably the longest <laughs> we've lasted in quite a bit. Uh, yeah. us. We probably said something before that that was totally worth. It. <laughs> All I right. Mean, uh, been so, there, done that. what would you like to check in, ma'am? Oh, of course. Um. Well, there's a few things I would like to check in. Well, the yeah, youngest uh, Florence dad is watching. I mean, I have a um, chest that could be usable. Um, some manacles. Oh, that fucking chest. Yeah, I still have the chest. Yes, I have the. They're chest. still carrying a whole damn chest. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's been carrying her shit inside. Just a, I is. just imagine a CL lugging this like fucking worn chest across the mountain while she's pushing these people on her fucking psychic board. Like I'm so done with this whole fucking adventure. Get me the fuck out yeah, of here. Maybe that's why she couldn't climb the fucking mountain. Just climbing to the. And then it's getting worse and worse. Spin this. Keep spinning. This is worse. I love it because the more you think back on the adventure, the wilder it gets. Like, oh yeah, we were naked that whole time. Oh yeah. Like, what about this? Yeah. Your, your guys' titties were totally frostbitten if we were going by any real world rules. Yeah, no, yeah, no, no shit. Oh, yeah. 
Yeah, but, um, I do have a bottle of ink, an ink pen, sand, a small knife. I would say the lore book, but then there's the fact that it's a, it's a lore book, in which I have to return it at some point. Some point. Yes, some point, and I would prefer not to. And I got this other book that's damaged, but I'm not, these two I'm not betting on using real supposed to and hopefully no one gets noted good to know all right with the exception of the ruby which we always yeah. do specialty items at uh, barter values you know we, we never know what kinds of ruby will come in a good one or a bad one uh everything uh... else will be treated at the standard price for its value you can I'm... exchange it now for money and reclaim it later or you can come back and exchange it here or at our any of our other exchange desks at any time. Uh, but I'm not done yet. I do. I mean, other than this cloak that I'm wearing, I do have a sta- uh, spear on me that's magical. How magical? It kind of kindly shows off the spear, the tree spear thing. Hmm. 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 Noted. I'm, Level I'm D mean, minus magic item, section 4A. I mean, it's a lot. It's probably worth price to be more than just D. Uh, I mean, it's okay. You gotta remember I mean, what we deal with here, young lady. Yes, yes, I do. I am aware. It's just that it is definitely would probably make someone's day. Probably if they got it. Did it make your day when you got it? I mean, I used it to poke some a uh, poke. <laughs> Doesn't, it doesn't sound like it maybe made your day. It did. It did when I don't have, I think. Let's see. <laughs> I don't have any other means of weaponry. And she just goes on a tang- a reminder of how she had a dagger originally, and that dagger got shattered. And she looks wayward and Carly. <laughs> when did I shatter a dagger? I don't remember this. You did shatter it when we were fighting those gnomes. Oh, with the spell shatter! Oh, yeah, I did that. Yes! Yes, yes. Yeah, I did that. Yes. Do you want my dagger? I can give you my dagger. I don't no, use it. No, 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 I'm just saying. But I'm just telling this yet another wonderful gentleman that because he said it didn't make my day. And clearly it did if I had to use I had to use it. Well. Other than, other than that, I do have a spell book. What? Which does have some spells. Small spells in it, but it's not noteworthy, you know. Do you have any spells above the fifth tier? Sadly, no, I am not. A- Do you have any spells that could be categorized as rare and or hard to find? Sadly, no. I mean, unless you need one that involves carrying stuff like this lovely floating disc spell. Hmm. I'll check our archives. I mean- I mean, I would bet someone would love the fact that not to have to lug around someone's things. We'll, uh, we'll have to compare it with what's in the archives and rank it. I'm not sure if I've seen that one. So you may get a boost while you're in the casino. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yes, but also what about Find Familiar, too? Because I bet someone would love a free band. Well, if you'd like to have them valued as a betting item, for sure. No. No, 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 not as a betting item. It's just, but it's just that we're, you know, checking them in, so why not make the detailed notice? It's good to know. Is there anything else you'd like to check while we're here? Um, let's see. Uh, let's see. What about that scroll that ends up, uh, what about the scroll that she picked up, that the one that had the explosive room? Does that exist, or just... She's just gonna pull out a paper. Uh, I mean, perception roll. <laughs> that is good. I'm doing this with friggin' advantage. <laughs> there you go. All right. Yes, it's a real explosion scroll. Explosion yeah, scroll. Really, yeah really she does kind of says, but also, but this might be interesting to someone. I mean, it's an explosion. Room. Ooh. Explosion. We stopped dealing in ruins. They don't work well in the casino. They tend oh. to go violent on their own. Hmm. We'd, we'd uh. ask that you check that here. You can have that tax-free on your exit. 
Of course. Okay, that would be Write that easy. down, we get to have that tax free back. Yeah. Florence's exploding rune. <laughs> Checked uh... in. Can get back free. And other than that, I think there's only the arcane that you know most standard mages have. In my case, it's a crystal, which, which you kind of just kind of show what would be probably part of the necklace, because it was a necklace before the realization that I would. It used to be a necklace, but now it's strung, not strung up. It's strung out. No, it, I mean, if it was made the what was holding it up was made of, you know, rope or whatever. Mimic on it. But left the. I can hear that, Florence. Do you hear that? It's the what? sound of the rope going right over your head. Bum, bum, oh. bum! Okay, <laughs> I am sorry. I'm sorry. Do you want me to? Florence kind of looks at I'm sorry, mine is not as entertaining as yours. It's okay. Not everyone can be as entertaining as me. Of course. Now, do you hear the sound of that? What? That's the sound of sarcasm just going over your head. No, I don't think it went over my head. Yes. No. no. You think, da, think da, Every, da. Everything goes over my head. I'm short. Ha. <laughs> short joke. <laughs> Anyway, okay, talk, talk. are we are, are we ready to go into Le Casino? I am. Yes. Wait. Wait. <laughs> wait. 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 No, you leave that shit alone. I swear to God, you fucking gamble away my shit. I will make you all pay. It's just, I mean, we have to be fair. We have to check in everything we're bringing in. I mean, exactly, even our in including our. You can um, just hear Carly already imagining the things she's going to bet with this fucking time. <laughs> yep, and see, this is why Florence is not doing anything. She's not picking so, this fight. Yeah, yeah. Two things. Two things. First of all, I'd like to check what's on him. Um, is that an investigation check or a perception check? Yeah, no, I'm not sure. I mean, you're investigating. That's what I would think. Yeah. yeah, so they're also the same number, so it doesn't particularly matter. Yeah. Can again, she can Florence have Ursul help assist in this chaos? I guess so. Yes, because she's not directly doing it. Indirectly, it's a beautiful Didn't you get thing. killed already for fucking with this stuff? No. No, she didn't. I know, she you got didn't. killed for fucking with someone else fucking with this stuff. Don't you think this is already yeah. going down a bad path for you? Yeah. Uh, um, I got a 15. Good. I mean, but she's already probably gonna catch hell for the fact that she so, did. So, uh, I mean, it's not like Wedge's stuff is well hidden. He's, he's, his clothes weren't even on before he went unconscious. Yeah. The first time, not the second time. To be fair, I mean, when he finds out that she packed his happy ass in a snowball and kicked it down the mountain, I think that's gonna be more than warranted already. Well, he's gotta remember that first. Yeah, that's mm. it. But, but what does he have on him? Uh, pretty much just that bow and arrow and those weird clothes he's wearing. No snake? Remember the snake went with Donnie, because someone had to keep the snake warm. Do we have Donnie? Donnie's somewhere else. <laughs> Shit. So Wedge has it? the bow and arrow, and weird clothes. In All which, right, um, uh, in which Florence kind of pipes up, and also there was a pet snake of mine. <laughs> it's somewhere. somewhere. Yeah, in which. So Did you just call that pet snake yours? <laughs> She's gonna try to do something because if she, if she, okay, but if I don't do it, Carly will do it. She will try to sell the damn thing. Keep this in mind. I would. I would never try to sell him. I'd gamble him and I would win. <laughs> See? 
you know, if this goes badly, this is going to turn horribly for everyone in the AU, right? Oh, of course. <laughs> you got yeah, no. to be an impartial DM, man. You got to keep all your feelings pent up and release them as weird characters with funny names. See. Or just so strike awesome. them down with lightning. Lightning directly from the sky. 20 bolts of it directly in a row. Reflex dodge that. <laughs> Also, I would like to say the the AU uh, the AU uh, uh, chat has has varied wildly at the point where we leave the carnival. So I feel it is no longer even the same universe. I know I'm about to say that because uh, it's we... like it's a completely different universe. <laughs> yeah, I'm about to say this is like no, this is. Yep, this is a uh, way off of the course of it. That's the thing about different universes. Karma's transcended that. To be fair, at least Florence is trying to save a snake rather than watch Carly pet it. Well, as long as as long as she can't find it, she's not going to assume it's with us. She would have assumed it fell off in the mountain roll. Anyway, I turn to the teller guy and I say, "Is." Is there a way we could, like, wake him up? He's, like, undead, so our healing spells don't really work on him. Well, you could go gamble him some health. What happens if we lose? Uh, well, since he can't gamble his health while he's sleeping, well, here, he can't gamble it. But anyway, he'll know about that. Uh, anyway, you guys will have to put your health on the line, gamble, get extra health, and give it to him. Almost like a simple necromancy spell, right? Yeah, I mean, or a restore spell. Yeah, but whoa, 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 necromancy whoa. tends to have a little bit of flavor. Flick a way of thinking yeah. about it. An outside I, of, I, you know, true resurrection. Or we can do that, though. Where could we do that? Wait a minute, what is this we? Ford's kind of looks at Carly like, no, 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 no. I'm a mage. I hardly have any health. What's your, what's your max health? 20 freaking two. Okay, I have 33. I have some to spare. See, and Ford looks at you like, yeah, no. We're doing this with some reason. Some sense of reason. And I get to yeah, pick I the game. To spare. We're going to pick the game that we can probably both evenly match. If one screws up, the other one can get right. Okay. Either something that works in bullshitting or common is something of logic. So poker or riddles. Yeah, exactly. This is how this boils down to. So I will say that we are done. We're done checking everything in. Mm -hmm. Well, that's good. Uh, would you like a tour? Absolutely. Yes. So, uh, the, the Modrons come back, including Mike, as well as the Pentagon. Hey. And they, uh, they... Mike, 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 Mike. Which Florence kind of feels bad for the one that's called Mike and pats him on the head. Mike uh, happily accepts your pat on the head. This poor thing, he he's nice! He didn't drop, attempt to drop me, and he's absolutely nice. You lords of being nice to the one Modron everybody just doesn't. Poor Mike. Somebody has to be nice to him. Yeah. Sure. But Mike flies you up, uh, as well as the speaker who comes with you using the pentadrome. And you guys fly uh, to the right towards the golden ship. He says, this here is our intermediate area. Uh, here you can gamble on a wide assortment of different uh, physical things, including jewels, money, guns, property, people, pretty much you name it. If you could touch it, you can play with it on this ship. Of course. This ship is also happens to be part of our... Uh, non-cheating side. Just just letting you know most of the things on the bottom half of this ship are non-cheating, top half cheating. So, ah. going to the right, 
we have our, you know, our typical kind of gambling area. This is uh, where you can do some money. However, in addition to being some of our older games, you also have a section in here where you can bet on more of the metaphysical concepts, things that are intangible. Age, love, hate, death, life. It's a great time. Mm -hmm. Truly great. He flies back over to the left and past the gold ship. Are you saying looking in the bottom right? Yeah. Okay. Got a quick question. Um, what about magical items? Where would those be? Counted? Ah, magical items. And he flies up to the next ship, which is up above you guys. He says, here we have all magic and magical items. This includes all different types of magic, bardic, sorceress, etc. In fact, you can become a sorcerer here. You can become a warlock or a witch or a wizard, Harry. Interesting, because, you know. Yes. Uh, then we come up to the cheating side. This one actually mirrors the opposite side on the lower right and is our section for uh, gambling against the house. All of our other sections are for interpersonal gambling, thus our need to use attacks. However, this is the section where you gamble against the house. Ooh, and... So the right gold ship is that? Yes, that's the cheating section playing against the house. Now, I've got a quick question. Do you have one that, um, ones that are the, you know, place? Does it have one that is more, more or less? Revolving around with puzzles or, um, not puzzles, but riddles. Riddles. <laughs> ah, puzzles and riddles. Mm -hmm. You'll want to go into our secondary side ship, which is the ship all the way across, and they fly you back over to the left side ship. Mm -hmm. It says, this section is mostly focused in riddles. We also have various types of books and other things here. Uh, this is a cheating side boat. However, the sides switch once a day to accommodate our different uh, types of games to allow some to cheat during some times and others to not. Okay, so cheating flips sometimes. Yes, we do and announce it's not like it. A secret. No, no, it's not a secret. Okay. Oh, all right. I mean, that sounds lovely, but I mean, I really not want to. Flat out. I mean, if you have the common sense or studied, you should know the answer. You know what I mean? I'm nerd. Sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, you meant her. I know. Yeah, I meant her. Yeah, because <laughs> yeah, uh, Florence kind of says, well, I would really wish the case of, you know, being able to keep it. You know, if you knew the answers, you know the answers. So I don't see. Why would you want to, per se, want to cheat on something as arbitrary as riddles? Do you have a spell that can make you read people's minds? Some people do. That would be I... a really good spell to have in a riddle game. Some people yeah. are able to do other things. Yeah, but the thing is, those spells generally are your divine spells. True. Which are we get quite which are, quite a many diviners come to our tables to win and lose money. Oh, so I, there's a, there's no this might be a bit problematic. It's mostly lose, don't worry. Mm, but it's still. Well, here, if it makes you feel better, what we'll do is we will just come back to the riddle section when it's not cheating time. Yes. That sounds within reason. It's not what about the rest of the place? Yeah, that was. Well, as we said earlier, some of them mirror each other. So up to the top left, we have the cheating side of our basic gambling games, as well as our metaphysical concepts. You can also bet such things as memories. You can bet emotions and dreams and titles and whatnot. It's all quite legal. Our paperwork is pristine. Oh, and I believe our top yeah, half too. section here, the boat, which is our last unexplained section. Mm. I don't remember what this one is. They just added it. Uh oh. Oh, oh geez. You'll have to come and see. They're always adding new additions to the place. 
I mean, that does sound lovely, but like I said, I'm as you can kind of guess from my um, companion friend here talking. Oh, uh, it has been probably has said I'm more of a bookworm. You know what I so, mean? So, just to make sure I got it all right, the bottom gold ship is the intermediate area where we can gamble physical things, and it's not cheating. The yes. bottom right is the older games, and you can gamble metaphysical things like memories, your life, and ma and other shit like that. Yes. The top right is magic stuff. Could become a wizard here. Warlock. There's whatever. a difference. There's a difference. Right. Do not say whatever. That's like whatever. calling. Right. That's like calling. That's like calling a sorcerer and a bard the same thing. They are the same thing. Yeah, I mean, I can I can make some magic in some places. Um, the right gold ship is cheating, <laughs> where you're playing against the house. The left gold ship is riddles and books and stuff, but that's cheating right now. I missed what the top left section was, but it mirrors the bottom right, so that's older games where you gamble the metaphysical things, um, but it's cheating. Yes. And then the top boat, we don't know what that means, but yeah. that is. That's a good breakdown. Okay. Older games, metaphysical. And just for everyone at home so that they can follow along if they ever end up doing so. No one watches. Cries. So we'll stop for our um, bottom right. Bottom right. No cheating. Metaphysical. Older games. Top right. Cheating. Magic stuff. Top left. Cheating. Metaphysical. Older games. Bottom left. No cheating, magic stuff. Bottom boat, physical, cheating. Not cheating, sorry, non-cheating. Left boat, riddles, cheating, currently. Top boat, unknown. I guess we did go over right boat. Am I missing right boat? I have right right boat as cheating playing against the house. Yeah, that's what okay, yeah. Alrighty, let's see where we're we going with this hell right. I've right. already had a full page of notes. Yeah, it's easy yeah, to do my, my adventures. Mm -hmm. Speaking of, it's your move! Where would you guys like to go? We will drop you off. Should Wedge be awake for this? We do have a pet daycare, however it costs money. Mm. Um, the thing, bigger thing is we need to get him awake. So, as much as I hate the cheating side, but has a better chance of us actually, you know, seeing if we can try. Well, we can we can go to the we can go to the bottom right where it has the older games, um, where we can gamble the metaphysical things, but it's non cheating. Yeah, non cheating. But what kind of ga uh, those games are probably not my forte or not my best experience. Yeah, when you say older games, what do you mean? Yeah, that's... Well, that's probably well we best. have some more modern games, you know, things such as craps and blackjack and roulette, and then we have some older's game. Older games, liar's dice, odds and ends. I mean, there's other ones, but those are the big two right now. Um, what about 21 or buff? 21's are in the, uh, that's in the newer games. Also, that one is usually played against the house. Uh, of course. Though not always, you can find 21 on several of these other ones. Also, I thought 21 was just blackjack. No, uh, 21 is, uh, is definitely not blackjack. But, 
we can talk about that when we teach you 21 and stuff. Okay. <laughs> I, like, I like how this can is you one repeat what, Can you repeat what the older games are? Uh, you have like Liar's Dice. You have... One second, I gotta pull out my list. Because they're old. Yeah. Put on the wrong list, damn it. Uh, so you have Jip, Liar's Dice, Tomorrow's Spinner, uh, 21 actually is also in the older games. Oh. Okay. I think we should go there. Yeah. And gamble Wedge Awake so that he can walk on his own and stop being a lazy fuck. Uh, of course. Or... Uh, I say this while I am sitting on the disc. I should say. In which Florence kind of looks at you and says, but at the same token, you're sitting on the disc. I am acknowledging that I am a lazy fucker. But then again, there's a few exceptions of reasons why I'm going to let this slide for the sole fact of I got to- I, I, I had some fun for five minutes. Yeah, exactly. And that fun induced was put him in, in a snowman kind of get up. And then- <laughs> and then just put him off and watch that- I really happen. hope you gave him boobs. I can't remember. Yeah, I, I mean, I did- I, I couldn't make it into a full-blown snowman because, you know. Oh. But next time. Was, yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely next time. Because there's probably going to be a next time. Probably. He's suicidal. We should um, probably get him some help. Or at least something to keep him doing it. Uh, Just gamble away his anyway. mental problems. His what problems? His mental problems. Oh, nice. That'd be really fun. Yeah, oh god, if you lose that one, if you lose that bet, you get worse mental problems. <laughs> Ooh, this will be a fun game. Okay, okay, okay. So we really should go down to the older game section where we can gamble metaphysical things, non-cheating. Yeah, non-cheating. This, non yeah. this time. Very well. And uh, he flies you down and he drops you off right here at the doorsteps things. And you guys want to move to ask one more question before leaving. Um, are we allowed to bring a, cer a certain moment term if we want to be moved to another area? Uh, you can. Uh, if you want a certain Motron, you're going to have to call them by name, and the Motrons do enjoy tips. Tips, yeah. tips, 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 tips. Well... They enjoy it, the tip. <laughs> Inc oh, wait a minute. But what about Mike? Mike? Shame, 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 shame. No! No, he's a good Motron. Hold on. We love him. And we want to take him. Yes, and we want to give him a pet. You know, I just realized something about these Modrons. Uh, yeah. They can they could basically sit there and do like that one fucking app does. Where it mimics what you say. And um, so they sit there and they hear, Mike. They go, shame, 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 shame. Eventually gets to the point where... One didn't hear Mike, and all they hear is shame, and then they start going, Mike, 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 yeah. Mike, 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 and then back to the other side, and it's going, shame, 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 shame. If you had a much larger group of Modrons, it would work. <laughs> you just, that's, that's how you defeat a Modron army. <laughs> <laughs> this is why Floris is like, <laughs> Mike, the does secret it, defeater of the Modron army. <laughs> Does the tip have to be like coinage? Can it just be like this? And she got a pet for Mike on the head. Like he deserves at least some yeah. niceness. And Mike goes, Mike, and everybody else goes, shame. Also, there's a kraken. Is there any chance I, you are our guest allowed to talk to him? Uh, no. You can win him though. I mean, you can win the kraken. Yeah. What do you have to bet to get the Kraken? You don't want to know. Oh, I very much do. Well, the last it's... time someone came, they tried to bet a country. Carlos didn't like that. Felt mm. underappreciated. I mean, I'm not trying to win a Kraken. I'm just trying to interesting. I mean, it's an interesting study. 
Well, the contest is to beat Carlos in chess. So if you can beat Carlos in chess, you win. Uh, I mean, I wouldn't want to. I mean, I mean, it's a crime. Yeah. Yeah, that's what it's we told the guy who wanted it. I mean, I get why they want a Kraken, but at the same token, I don't think he's com if he's not comfortable with it, I would think he, you know, he would don't want to do that. Yeah, I mean, he is a Kraken. You don't want to fucks with a Kraken. I mean, not necessarily growing up, but it's more of, it's the fact that, I mean, I... Anyway, you guys are all over it. here at the, the, uh base of the steps over here on the right side. So I should move myself. Ah, where did I go? As well as the fact that, I mean, it's a giant le leviathan. A levi leviathan. <laughs> yes. Ah! It's a giant leviathan. Oh, fucking egg. English. Love that. Guys, I'm, I'm having a hard time, guys. Oh, God. I'm having a hard time talking. Are, sure, are we sure we're starting off this lovely? I don't have a computer mouse. There we oh. go, I moved myself. I was gonna say, if you need me to move you, just let me know. And I will move you. Got it. I will move Wedge. I got it. Since I'm the only one who can. Uh, where do I move Wedge? Uh, where do I go there? They kind of like thump Wedge's body on the ground. Nice. Which Florence is... <sighs> I think we really should start out small for this because we don't really care if he's like on death's door or whatever. So we could probably just like gamble like one hit point and give it to him. Yeah, I would think that makes sense. At least something bare. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah, I think, I think that'd be fair. I think yeah, that'd be fair. That's mm -hmm. fair. I mean, I mean, I've gotten my kid. Oh! Hey, quick math. Um, so we have, I have this ruby worth 7,500 gold. If I were to cash that in gold, how much is the minimum amount I have to give to Florence if we lose that 750 to get off the island? Well, off the you, so you're, well, I would have to write you a math equation to solve that. I mean, yeah, I because it's a sliding scale. Because it's how much you lose, you can't lose everything and pay your way off the island. Yeah. You know, all right, well, if you don't spend anything but what you spend on the ruby, it simplifies it. So you're saying out of that seven, if you've lost all seven and five? Yeah. You'd have to pay something like 1,500 gold. Okay. So I give Florence 2,000 gold. No. Okay. I will give Florence 2,000 gold. Yeah. Because Florence apparently is the more responsible person here. I think we all know Do that. Do you trust Carly with the money? No, not in the slightest right now. I think we all know Yeah. That. So... Yeah. So, we should head inside then. Mm, let me just make sure. Let me just make sure. Well, I gotta write down that I promised Florence 2,000 gold. Yeah. 2,000. Two thousand. Promise Florence two thousand gold, cause she's a wet blanket. I'm not a wet blanket when I'm trying to be reasonable. Wet blanket. I also say as you enter in, you uh, you look around and see while the bar isn't full, or not the bar, the casino isn't full. Yeah, there are a, a, a fair number of people running around gambling. Okay, so you just only have to give Florence like two uh, two hundred um, platinum. Well, I don't have any money yet. Yeah. It's a ruby. It's a ruby right now, Florence. I know. I'll cash it out if I need to. I know. I know. I know. I'm just just sorting this out so you don't have to give her like. A full thing of you know what I mean yeah just for that you're getting it in copper pieces don't you dare don't that you would just dare. be <laughs> 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 that anyway so what games are available 
So we have lay studies, we have group in 21. So this, I forget, this was older games. So yes, we have uh, Anti Up, we have a bunch. You, What I would say is to head to a table and see what it is. I will head to... Hmm. Let me just kindly put how much copper pieces that would be. Go for it. I will. Well, in the meantime, I'll head to this table. I'll send, I said, put it in general. This one. Uh, why am I not selecting? How do I select again? How do I make the thingy happen? That one. No. no. <sighs> this one. This one. This one. Hey, you there you me? go. There's your answer to how much copper pieces that would be. I'll look in a second. I want to go to this table. This one right here. All right, so you're going to that one right there. So mm -hmm. uh, as you uh, come down to it, they say hello and welcome. This is uh this is our blackjack table. Hmm, blackjack. So explain to me explain to me the game as if I've never played it before. It's very simple. It's very, very, very simple. Mm -hmm. So here's how you do. You put your ante down and he puts, you know, some coins on the thing. And you're going to get two cards. One face up, one face down, so that I can see one of your cards and you can see one of my cards. We each get one. Well, we each get two. One up, one down. Am I explaining this right? I don't know. <laughs> and, you? and he says, each of the cards dealt out have a value. The numbered cards have the value listed. Any face cards, except for the ace, have a value of 10. The ace can either have a value of 1 or 11. And that is blackjack. Okay. Also and known as 21. And how much you need to get to? 21? Yes. Well, okay. you want to get as close to 21 as you can. Usually you're trying to beat out the dealer, but here we only do verses. This is not against the house. So, the versus dealer does who? Versus whoever is willing to come to the table with you. Okay. Would you like to sit down and play? I look at Florence. Do you want to sit down and play with me? Um, I... It's part of my team. We're not playing against each other. Yeah, no, we're not playing against each other because I'm... Like... But I What's can't... the minimum bet? What's the minimum bet? Well, at this table here, we play for... Well, actually, you're here first, so you get to set the stakes. Mm. The minimum bet is what I set, but you have to set the stakes. What's the difference? Out of character, what's the difference? So, stakes are what you're betting. The minimum is how much you have to. Oh, so I don't get to guess them. I don't get to say the minimum. Ugh. No, never at a casino. Okay. Casino Stakes sets the minimum. Whoa. Say I were to set the stakes at health points. What would the minimum be? Well. The minimum would most likely be 15 health points. And so a reminder, the minimum is not just the minimum. It is the minimum amount that you are allowed to bet when you raise. Oh. Oh. Yeah. See, yeah. see this is why, and you hear Florence so said, this is why I'm not doing it. I, I know that for a fact that got to hurt. <laughs> That's like taking pure necrotic damage, am I correct? It would actually be more like taking negative 
damage or whatever, so it's like negative energy damage. Well, I think 5e's instance of that is necrotic. Yeah. Yes, it is necrotic, and the opposite of that is radiant. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah. I, was, yeah. I missed 3-5 when it was just negative energy. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Right, um, so 15, that sounds like a lot. Uh, you probably find... Yeah, you won't find any better odds than that, probably. Hmm. At least what not if it's down like, here. What if it's... What do you mean down here? Where else would we find better odds? You might find some better odds against the house. No, not odds, sorry. Not better odds. Better minimums. But... Against the house. But you'll have do lower they gamble odds. This? Do they gamble this stuff? Metaphysical stuff? They do in certain sections. We could just let him stay quiet. Yeah, we need to stay quiet. As you say that, uh, a couple people are eyeing the table and start uh, moving towards it. Mm, 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 mm. Um, 15? Yes, 15 yeah. per hand. Oh, boy, per hand. Hey, quick question um, for the DM, out of character. How hard is this game to win? Against the house, it's a little harder, but uh, against somebody else, it's even chances. Because the reason the house wins is if if you don't beat the house, right? Or if you tie against the house, any of that shit, the house wins. Mm. Like, and not only that, you have to keep pulling until you beat the house. That's because, it's a, because there's a game. They count the cards. It's right. well, that's who. But it, the 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 point being that the the reason that is is because, uh, it forces you to bet when you're in danger or to push forward when you're in danger. Mm-hmm. Where so the house Out of has their curiosity. Cards you're explaining blackjack basically to them, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's just blackjack. Hmm. Which once again, when you don't do dealer has advantage, is just one one versus one odds. You're just betting your luck against somebody else's. Okay. This is a deep. Side. And this is the meeting section. Yes. Hmm. To be fair, unless you have a deck of cards on you, blackjack is kind of hard to cheat at. If you're playing against other people, all you have to do is see their cards. You know what we have? That doesn't guarantee you a win, though, in blackjack. No. That's the thing. Of, fake it better. That's that's the thing about pure luck games, as opposed to odds or other games, is you could also have bluff and do other things, which is not cheating. But, for instance, right, if he gets 21 in his hand, no amount of cheating you do is really going to beat it out. Unless, mm -hmm. once again, you shuffle the deck and cut the cards and have cards to cut in when you need to, stuff like that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, 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 uh. I'm so tempted. I love that Damn you came to the cheating, non-cheating section and they're like, well, actually, let's go cheat. <laughs> we already discussed this. Coralie I said, what if? I said what if. <laughs> I know, but it's just the, it's the contemplated thought. It, it's up to you guys. He says, he says there are other games around. You might try your luck at some of them, but, you know, we're here if you want to play. And he smiles devilishly. Hmm. What's that? What's that one saving throw you do? Is it wisdom? For to resist. You're not stuff? doing a stupid thing to resist stuff. Yeah. Uh, I believe that used to be a would... will, which is wisdom stuff. It is wisdom. Yeah, it's wisdom. This Let's is why see. I don't like the new classifications. I always get stuck in the past. Yeah, but okay, it, it still starts with a W. I know. That's I why. That's why it's more. I'm able to confusing. overcome this temptation. Okay. Go for it. I'll, I'll circle back. 
You're gonna have to. You're gonna have to roll for it. Oh, I did. I rolled an eighteen. Do you think that was high enough? Is it? Is it high enough? Yeah, we'll say it's high enough. Okay. <laughs> I mean, it was at least double digit. Do we need to talk about me and me trying to climb the damn mountain because I'm a certain idiot? Hey, look, that was even funnier. <laughs> yeah. No, yeah, All right, no, so you, you've, you've resisted your temptation. What would you like to do now? I would like to kind of idly look around the the casino and then look at Florence and I say, what, there's, I'm in, I'm a kid in a candy store, Florence. I, I'm lost as to what I do. I, I don't, I never thought I'd get this far. I don't know what to do now. You're lost. Try putting me in, in like I said, if you had went to that library, how much of a field day do you think I would be in? And now that you mentioned oh, that, you. I want you to make a will save as well. Wait, what? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Wait, what? Yep. I introduced the idea of temptation saving throws, and now I've, oh, I no, know I've ruined it, it. It's not even that. This I don't want to ruin it, but out of character, this place has magic on it to make you gamble. Oh. Yeah, why uh, Why wouldn't they? Think about it. How much money do you think they would make that way? Sneaky. They're you, sure you, will, uh, you get, wisdom saving. You, you get a bit distracted, but but uh, you're lucky enough to, to have a little dragon on your shoulder nudging you away from danger and giving you advantage. That's <laughs> yes. How, that's how I explained advantage rolls. Yes. Okay. Which Florence kind of just looks at the uh, uh, Ursul. Thank you. Well, do we even want Wedge awake at this point? He's I still mean, on the we'll... stairs back there, by the way. I mean, if we have him awake, he gets himself, you know, patched up. And they did say there was, you know, pretty much fighting ring. He would have a field day. Mm -hmm. Think about it. It's a little bit more of a win-win situation when you know what what you're doing. Well, we'd want him to have more than fifteen hit points. Oh, of course, naturally. Hmm. But also, at the same rate, us betting a chance of him being fully patched up—that means one of us. Hmm. So you think we should do it? I mean, it's a hell of a risk. And the thing is, even if we do oh, get him to wake up, there's no way he's going to stay stay long around me long enough to say get him uh, get himself fully healed up. Just... Mm -hmm. Unless he gambles for his health. Um, yeah, I could cast suggestion on to make him stay. I'm immune to mind affecting things. You can fuck off. <laughs> See, this is. See, but what if we make you truly alive? Make you a real boy? <laughs> I don't want to be a real boy. I like being fake. You should have shouldn't have jumped off the mountain then. You basic bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I like how this is being keep kept going. This is perpetuated by us both. Just like okay, we're just gonna have to make sure he's have his behind. Stay safe, some. You. You know what we could do? I'm so dumb. There's an exchange table. So if we get enough money, we might be able to get him healed up in exchange for money. Is that right? Is that a thing that's here? No, we don't We do not do that. Fuck. So pretty much uh, the equivalent exchange. Oh, it has to be of, e I'm guessing, of equal value. In which, in this instance, money is not going to be equaling health. It all depends on how much money. Now, Car oh, Carly, we have to be a little bit reasonable here. I mean, you have the 2,000 gold. Okay. It's, it's as good as in your pocket right now. Yeah. yeah. Wait, how do we, how do we give 15% of our winnings if it's health? We will evaluate how much health was won, and decide how much it's worth. Which, can we get a guesstimate of how much would that be evaluated as? Well, how much health are we talking? 
enough to get someone on their feet. At least one point. One or point. Or at least the bare minimum. Ah, you know, we'll do it for 100 gold. Can I just give you 100 gold and you'll heal him a hit point? Well, we'll give you a hit point's worth of heal. Health. I don't, I don't know how, what you'll do with that. It's not for me. It's for our, um... I see. Also, uh, unfortunately, Mummy. we do deal in minimums. Uh, as well as here and on the table. So you would have to pay for 15 points of healing. Which would be I don't think I like 50. him that much. Lloyd's <laughs> got a smile, Snickers. Yeah, this is accurate. I mean, I mean, but then again, it's just that we. I don't think you're keen on lugging him around anymore as much as I am. No, but you're doing all the heavy lifting here. Heavy lifting is an understatement of the year. Okay, wait. We should. So we we're doing this completely backwards. We should start small and then work up to this. Yeah. <laughs> I so, love that you come in and you're like, should we gamble? I don't know. We're gonna, gonna sort, we got to sort out our issue here that we have a uh, KO'd wedge that probably is more useful uh, when he's all awake and what. But he is sleeping and he's probably been sleeping for about an hour. Yeah, but I don't think that's how this works for um, a dead. It just takes time to heal him up, right? Axel, how do you want to run this? Because you have the mummy. You have I mean, the mummy step. Yeah, he just, he, he'll heal after he rests. Uh, and he's resting now? I mean, yeah. For like, I don't know, maybe an hour. Yeah, so we only have seven more to go. So someone has to keep an eye on him, though. Yeah, he'll just follow along behind us. Well, you gotta have something carry him. Um, Florence will just make the friggin' floating disc again. Yeah, that's the thing about the uh, non-cheating section, no magic. What? Yeah. That's that. That makes sense. Hashtag well, get fucked. Well, How am I no supposed cheating. to carry my pet? Where's you, Mike? You can rent a pet dolly or tip Mike. Does... Can I give Mike a gold? Yeah. Can I... Can we offer... Mike, uh, pets for it is in a tip. I mean, he enjoys them, but I don't know if he'll carry Michael for that. Maybe one of you two. That sounds... I mean, at least, I mean, I'm a little bit more nicer to him. I will give Mike a gold if he will carry our, our wedge. Well, just call out his name and see, see if he comes. Okay, hold uh... on. Usually that's not how that works. You know, it isn't usually, but sometimes when you... Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> you my... just have to believe. Yeah. So, so so I cut my hands around my mouth and I say, Mike! And uh, out of the sky you see fly uh, Modron. 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 <laughs> And in the distance, you hear shame, 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 shame. <laughs> Mike, Mike, Mike. Just a constant cacophony. But he's a nice one. And he shows up and he says, Mike. Um, I'll give you this shiny gold piece if you carry a little friend over there. He turns around and he looks down at the gold and he's like, hmm. I offer Pretty please. I offer pets too. At which point Mike smiles and says, Mike. Is that a yes? Then he flies over and he picks up Michael. The yes. gay wedge. And I give I give Mike I give Mike a little smooch on his little Modron forehead. Uh, yes as well. Thank you, Mike. It's impossible to tell, but Mike is blushing. Aw. So he's cute. Wishing. And he's getting pets. Uh, then Mike files sexual harassment charges. Mike. <laughs> Mike, 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 Mike. Where did they touch you? Know you? Point, point on the Modron doll where they touched you, Mike. <laughs> uh, and, 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 he, and he then he just points to his forehead. Mike. You touched him directly in the genitals. 
Well, but that's his head. Modrons use their whole body to reproduce. Thank you very much. It just cracks. <laughs> yeah, I would. That is that is fucking great. I love it. Just D and D SVU. <laughs> what happened? I'm pretty sure that this uh, this bear was gang raped by orcs. <laughs> Why would you say that? Just sign on the wall. Grog was here. Something better and better. Anyway. Night, honey. So. Oh, good night. I just yeah, love to comment. Like just that. better and better. It's like, hey, look, I don't write this shit. It writes itself. It pretty, writes itself. Pretty much. But anyway, uh, what, what are you guys doing? We started out too big. We started out too big. We should just go to where we can gamble for money. And, yeah, and from there we can probably see if we can find a... I mean, they do... Uh, they do... If, wait a minute, got a quick question. They have a redeem shop, right? A pretty much where you can exchange things. Yeah, they have a well, transfer table. Yeah. Well, what about... Do they have it for magic items? Yes. All of the redeem shops function as what you did. That's nice. That's good. That's good. Because think about that. We can get a magic item. Could get a magic item. And it could be a good one. We could get close for probably like five gold. That'd be probably the biggest starter right now. Because we, I mean, we have the money for clothing, right? I mean, I have a lot of money. Yeah. What you have is what you have is your business. Exactly. <laughs> In which I have like fi uh, fifty gold pieces, and if we can get some clothes, we can get some clothes. That might, might be a good yeah. start. I, mean, I though am going to stay in this skimpy dress. You made it clean, right? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to stay in this skimpy dress because if we play against men or you know people who are attracted to women. And I kind of like, I kind of like mime sitting on a table and like leaning forward. And Florence kind of catches on to what the hell you're saying because she has a feeling I know where this is going. And I waggle my eyebrows. Uh, <laughs> you're freaking unbelievable. Everybody speaks the language of the body. Oh, At which course. point Thank you just, you. You, you just hear from behind me, you're the devil himself. <laughs> it's true. Who yeah. said? And you just you uh you it came from a lady behind you. Which uh, Florence I wink at her. She's not in looking in your direction. Oh, oh man, Florence got a sweat laughs are behind Elf. You see, this is why um there's a song for this, but I'm not going to go look for that song. <laughs> anyway, so let's just go to uh get you some clothes so you're not uncomfortable because. My lady partner's uh, uh, comfort is always my top priority. Um, so get you some clothes, and then we can sell whatever you're wearing now, because we're probably never going to see Matthew or Jameson again, let's be real. At which um... point... See, <laughs> <laughs> famous friggin' last words, ladies and gentlemen. I was see. literally, that wasn't even a response to what you were saying either. I've been planning to bring him back in for a second anyway. Yeah, I know, to move but the it's story, like, so it's like so so simple. <laughs> yeah, really freaking simple. Like you wrote yourself into that plate. I did. I did. I love it. Oh gosh, you, you guys sometimes just... make it so easy for me. You know that. <laughs> sometimes. Um, sometimes. Pretty often. All right. Be fair. Fair. Yeah, we know. We know. We write ourselves into these predicaments. Oh, I know. You guys love it though. Yeah. Oh, of course. Of course. It's like, why I'm wouldn't you? Definitely. It's it, why wouldn't you? It's just chaos and madness. Anyway, you see, uh, you see, Jameson. Oh, sorry, no, uh, Matthew walk up, and he is accompanied by some very tall women. Like taller than me, tall. Yeah. Yeah. So nice. they're taller than our happy asses. How are they dressed? Uh, pretty much just like you. Nice. 
I wave. I wave at them. They all wave and smile. Like, but you can tell they don't mean it. Same. Oh, same. At which point Matthew says, well, hello! Hello! How are you ladies doing tonight? Lovely. We're Wonderful. Getting, we're, yeah, we're getting ourselves some fun in. We just wanted to sort out some minor things like clothes. I mean, it's, it's th we're very thankful for the clothing. It's just that I don't think I want to be running around, you know, haphazardly like that. I'm saying in these. <laughs> You're the not. most evil goddamn bird I've ever met. You just hear from behind you. Is she looking at me yet? No. Damn it! I need attention! This <laughs> boy's not even gonna follow this up. Anyway, long story short, we're gonna see if we can get some advent a much more suited, well suited clothes, and then we're gonna go off from there. All right, so where are we heading? The exchange Please. table. See if we can get something. Yeah. All right. Well, the closest exchange table is down here. Uh, where did you ping? I'm sorry, I was looking at something first. Ah, okay. Lawrence will do that, and the ginger will make a say. Oh, so I see his way. I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go. And she's gonna do that. Go to the table. Alrighty. I before we leave, before we walk fully away from the from the uh, ladies, I put my hand in like one of those old phone like call me call me um windows as yes, I walk sure. away. Wait, who are you doing that to? The the ladies. Oh those ladies, <laughs> yes. They're like, bye Matthew's like no call like <laughs> Mike happily like flies it. wedge around with you. Yeah. And now I yeah. go back to Florence. Yeah. So, how about this is going? Oh, do you want me to take the lead on this? I mean, yeah, why not? I mean, generally speaking, do you do a good job, but, you know. Okay. Well, clean your dress first. Clean it. Mm. Yeah, and which Florence does that with, again, that spell. Gush we do that belt. outside where the magic works. Yeah, magic works. This one before. So then we go inside and we go to the table and I'm like, who's standing there, by the way? Uh, there's no Man one standing and... there. There is a bell on the table. Um... I very daintily ring the bell. Yeah. Uh, as you do, a giant spider descends from the ceiling. Hmm. Hi. Hi. Well, hello kinda... there. Florence kind of looks at it and it's just like amazed. And she's just like, I've read books about spiders. Awesome ones are incredible. I mean, can I not look in the boy spider or a girl spider? Uh, Amazing. you can try. Oh gosh. Perception? Yeah. But I'm making it subtle. I'm doing it like subtly. I got a dirty 20. Okay. You, you can tell that it kind of looks like a girl spider a girl spider okay and so i say am, am, am i sure it's a girl spider uh i mean as sure as you can be hmm. i'll say I mean. i'll say i'll say hello dear um my friend seems to be in need of clothes. She'd like to trade this lovely dress she's wearing now, made of the finest silks, uh, in for something a little bit more modest. Yes, please. Uh, it looks in and is like, all right, well, uh, we don't really do straight exchanges for clothes, so you'll have to exchange it for money and then exchange that money for other clothes. I mean, if nothing is, I mean, we do have money on us, so we can... You could Florence? just exchange that money for clothes. Um, out of character, do I know how much common, like, clothing costs? Uh, like, I've said a decent clothes. Yeah, I know. 
I mean, I don't technically add a character. You, I don't know. Do you? I mean, I think that would be common knowledge to everybody. Right, but out of character, do you know? <laughs> out of character? No, absolutely not. My character would probably know. Yes. Um. Yeah. Well, it depends. Are we talking like traveler's clothes? I just mean like the kinds of clothes that Florence would want. Something nice, like decent, but not like upper crust, you know? Yeah, so probably traveler's clothes. Which are like two okay. gold. Yeah. Two, two gold? gold. Okay. Yeah. okay. So mm-hmm. I, I, I mean, mean if not that, if not that, it could be clothing for cold weather. No, it's fine. Uh, we'll go with the, we'll go with a two gold price. I put my hand on Florence's shoulder and I gesture to the dress and I say, "This dress is something amazing. It is oh. made of the finest silks in this beautiful pink color. It's got this lovely lace border you see here, worth easily five gold. But I'll exchange it for three. It would sort. Sees where she's doing with this. It... Yeah, that definitely would make sense, but. If but the also next words weird... in your mouth aren't agreeing with me, I'm going to make you shut your mouth. Yeah, no, no, no. I'm agreeing, I'm agreeing, but also okay, the same it, it just that It's just that I thought we also would probably need at least some, you know, gear since most of it got displaced. Baby steps, darling, baby steps. Yeah, so I'll trade this lovely dress for three gold. Sounds like a fair trade. Make it four. Pause. Wait. <laughs> out of character. Out of character. Do I know how much this dress would cost? Uh, probably not. Not specifically. Um, does Florence get, yeah. get has an ideal of it since it is silk, right? It is. Yeah, so she, she can get a guesstimate ideal of it. I mean, how much is yeah, I guess. silk wise? Because if you're talking regular old silk, that's gold, 10 gold pieces for the silk itself. So yeah, but fine, clothes tr- are only 15 gold. Yeah. Oh. Okay, wait. Can you make one for me? Because I'm done. He's like, you I said mean, three. Even... <laughs> no, it, hold it, hold it, hold it. But Florence didn't agree to it because she had to agree to it for it to be completely. And think about this. Pride Silk, the one of the adventure items that go for 100 gold pieces. Keep this in mind. And a pride silk outfit is going to run about five hundred gold pieces. Two out of two out of character questions. One is lying allowed in the section. I mean, it's not technically cheating, so yeah. Words. Um. Two. Um. You said no retconning, right? Oh, I mean, it's just uh, I mean that they didn't. That they like didn't, she said, a deal like hasn't been said, stuck, so he's just stuck. doing. He's yeah. doing a uh, traitor banter uh, traitor. where he's like, "You said three, you can't you go back. Three, you can't go back." So I say, "I th- wait a minute, wait a minute, Florence. This yes, is, yeah. this this dress was a gift of. Uh, I'm looking at it now. Look, it it looks like a very fine silk. Is that pride silk? Uh huh. Yes. I mean, it, it has to be made with pride silk. It has to be." Okay, then I cannot part with this for just three. It has to be at least It's an insult to the it would, it would be an insult to the tailor that made it then if exactly. we go for and three. That's a steal. It's a steal because this could easily be sold for at least right. Probably right. probably up to maybe at least five hundred gold pieces. Hmm. I can go as high as, go as high 10. As 10. 10. 20. 15. 15. 17. 16 and 16 five copper and pieces. Five copper pieces. Deal. Fine. Uh, Florence, Fine. take it off. 
Yeah. Uh, can I please have a place where I can change and pace without every person staring? Yes, there are changing <laughs> yes, rooms back here. Back here. Yeah. Oh, uh, so in fourth kind of. We said gold, and copper. Yes. Which fourth will kindly take. The spider writes something in a notebook with one hand while the other hand counts out the change and the third hand is just like hmm, twiddling on the desk. Which force will, like I said, hand it? Uh, 16? 16? Yes. Yes. 16? 16 and a copper piece or? Three copper pieces. Three copper pieces. Six copper pieces. Maybe. It was six? My memory so so... is impeccable, sir. I feel like okay. that's not true, but okay. True, but okay. <laughs> it is now that I'm taking notes. <laughs> what do you think, heck? All right, so now we want some decent clothes for that wizard there that is now naked in your back room. Oh, um, sorry. Oh, sorry. Which floor? You just hear floor and say, "Yeah, I, 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 I have a name." Hey, hold on a second. Um. Axel, you want to talk about that note you just put in the chat? I know, I know. Look, some, Don't worry about it. somebody about might be somebody playing might blackjack be playing in the afterlife. What? Porky? What's he battling with? Look, look, all you need to know all is that there's, know there's no escaping, escaping from no gambling escaping in this casino. Game. All right, all right, all right, all right. Fine, fine, fine. We'll let him be as he is, and I will die of curiosity in the... <laughs> um, yeah. Back to in character. We need a dress. We need an actual outfit for our dear wizard. Um, I would say I could part with five gold for a set of traveler. Traveler. Wait, is it two gold for traveler's clothes? Close. Is that what you said, Florence? Um, for cold, a clothes of you know, for cold, cold weather, that's ten gold pieces. Tra Regular tra traveler's tra clothes are two gold pieces. Okay, I can part with one gold traveler. He looks at you and says, unfortunately, we charge a minimum of four for traveler's clothing here. I could go to Walmart, Fantasy Walmart, and buy traveler's clothes for two gold. D&D <laughs> &D Walmart, D &D huh? D&D Walmart, huh? Yeah. <laughs> and you hear Florence say, how about we make you a very lovely deal um, in for the price of two pieces of clothing? One would be for, a clo uh, you know, cold weather, and one for just reasonable climate. Four. And, yeah. For the price of two. Or, how about this? Um, I will trade uh, a gold and six copper. Uh, remember, it has to be a minimum of four. So, why not? Argue them down. I know. It's like, I know, unfortunately, we're unfortunately, not a clothing we're outlet, clothing and outlet, while we do enjoy bartering for your items, for your item, uh, we only have a limited supply of these supply items of here, these items. so they must be kept so at a stock be. value. Florence, yeah. how, comfortable you, how comfortable are you with nudity? Florence looks at you. They are near, it's like you have using the covers, uh, the the uh, curtains, like the covers of while she's just peeking out, as it gives her that look like, you better not. And plus, no one needs to see ACL, um, you know, in the net. I white. put, I put floor, four gold pieces on the counter. They better be damn good clothes. He brings you out brings a nice out a new nice set of travelers' set of clothes traveler in the pack. Clothes in <laughs> from from Walmart. From, from Walmart. <laughs> Fucking hell! <laughs> Stacey, like rips Stacey, the Walmart like, sticker Walmart off and gives it to you. <laughs> oh gosh! Oh my god! And then I fully throw the clothes through the curtains at Florence. To which Florence kindly takes them, like, freaking scrambles to put them on. In which she's just like, thank you! 
Sweet Jeebus, thank you. Don't worry, it came out of your 16 gold. Yeah, I kind of figured. Alrighty, you oh, girls are changed, girls are and well, one of you girls is changed and ready to go. Ready to go. Yes. By go, I mean By straight go, to hell for visiting go. this place of sin and decadence. So we... Go ahead. I mean, you say this, but yet you are aware that Florence is, you know... ...trying her best to keep her wits about her. <clears throat> so I want to go someplace where we can play blackjack against other people, but for... But for but money. For, for money. Okay. And hopefully not cheap. Alright, follow, All right. Me. follow me. Follow me. I follow. He walks over to Mike. He He's like, take him to the like, take blackjack. To the blackjack. Shame. No, Mike is very nice. He's very sweet to us. I know. I mean, that's all good, that's all I guess. Good. I take it you haven't told them yet, Mike. Them. Mike. Mike. That's what I thought. And he, he climbs back up to the ceiling. Up, Sorry, she climbs she... back up to the ceiling. I wish for like... Do? I mean, everyone does some minor mistakes. Mike. Thing. So Mike uh, uh, sits there for a second, and then he, second, and then he whistles out in whistles a really weird pitched tone. Pitch tone. And two more two Modrons more show up to come and up to deliver you unto your destination. You unto your de awesome, thank you. So now I will deliver you unto your destination. Mm -hmm. Just make it a little easier. It's going to be in the top middle boat. The... Isn't that cheating? No, actually. No, actually. That one's the mystery one. Oh, the mystery one. Cool, cool, cool. Mystery. But yeah, now you're on the top boat. Which? Ah. Happily just hugging uh, after thankfully thanking the Motron and Mike says, Mike, Mike says. As well as, that's the Mike for being very resourceful. But I am freaking glad to be in some real clothes. She as she kind of hugs herself in these clothes. <laughs> She's just happy in these. Carly just kind of adjusts herself in her dress. You know, makes her boobs look nice. Makes sure her hair is on point. And then scans the area. What is she? Uh, she sees a couple uh, tables, couple some tables, of blackjack, blackjack, some of craps, some craps, of roulette, some roulette, a whole bunch of good stuff. Bunch of good stuff. It really looks like it just really like your basic like average basic casino average. here. Why is this one a? Why did they not know what this one was? Is there an un unoccupied um, dealer? A couple, yeah. You got one over here and one over here. Okay. I go up to the one that's closest. And I say, and I say, Good day. Um, our tour guide tell us what this boat was. Could you give me some? Ah, well, this boat's, ah, still, well, under this boat's still under construction. And you just hear, like, at hear, almost like, as if on cue construction noises from below. Below. Cool. So currently, it's so just, currently it's whatever. just whatever. Whatever. Cheating, non cheating, oh. life, death, money. Life, death. So it's kind of a catch all. Yeah, this is, yeah, yeah. this is like the Nexus like table. The Nexus. That's like, so it does vary on table. Well, I mean, in here well, it does, I mean, yes, heavily. In here it does, yes. Okay. Uh, so no we'd be able to come? find a table where no cheating happens in blackjack. Yes. Yes. Okay, cool. That's Thank just you, my not dear. this table. And when she, Florence kind of pipes up, so I see you have other... I'm not saying uh, tops, but 
ship uh, ship part um tops like these. Does any one of them have something that is non cheating but trim uh, you know riddles? Uh, no, our riddle uh, section no, our is riddle going to be cheating, cheating for the next cheating. hour or so, and then it'll be back to non-cheating. What about... Wait a minute, what about fighting? Ah, yes, the fighting ah, yes, center. The that fighting takes center. place that in the pit. Place. Uh, is it cheating? Is magic allowed in there? Yes. Okay. Because I think I might have a crazy idea of how to, we might get... Some I love I mean, ideas. This idea is, um, if I can get a, if I can get a, like I said, a rapier, or something that is of assistance, of something along those lines, and say that I go into the fighting ring, they're not gonna expect a mage to go in there. It's true. Say you go up against a barbarian. The barbarian. I think that is true. But um, quick question, sir. If Someone is to fight in the pit. Is it? Is there like a? Can you pick your opponent, or at least one that is not going to be, or, uh, uh, too far advanced that is not a possible winnable match. Yeah. Is there like a weight class, but for skill level? Yeah. Uh, unfortunately, there is no divisions. Dig it. So we might. Or I might be picked at stacked against someone that. Can Easily <laughs> kick my behind. Yeah, that could easily turn into a little mist. Turn him into what? Blue mist. You cannot see, turn. I mean, no, well, no, see, I can't. you're a sea elf, and like when humans explode, they turn into pink mist. So if you're a sea elf and you explode, you turn into blue mist. It's quite clever, really. Mm, I mean, the more I think, if you think about it too much, the I, most, I, the most you might turn into is maybe a sea foam. I, or, I hate to uh, uh, burst uh, everyone's uh, bubble, but sea elves still, elf. still, bleed, still bleed red. Bleed red. I know. I know. I have no proof. <laughs> Yet we're hearing the metaphysical voice that is Wedge, even though we he hear, is. We hear the ghost of Wedge again. He's I know, not, right? dead not dead yet. Or at least not disembodied. Least not disembodied. <laughs> yet. I hear the word yet, and then I'm just thinking, yeah. Anyway. Thank you, my good man. I have no yeah. further question. Yeah. I will look for a non cheating blackjack team that plays against other people. Ooh, I lied. I have another question. What are they building? In uh, tomorrow's, uh, tomorrow's basement, basement is going to is be going a to be axe throwing a wheel. Axe throwing wheel. Tomorrow's basement? Yes, it changes yes. every day. Is every day. What's today's? Construction. 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 Yeah, uh, it takes a day. So construction it for it. Uh, uh, yeah, every other day. Sorry. Oh. Hmm. We all make. I'm just asking some understanding to be sure, because I would love to play participating in the game, but I would like to have a reason, I'm not saying a reason, but a feels like an easy, not, not easy, you know, within reasonable measure. We have a wonderful chance with the blackjack against other people. I mean, look at my boobs. Even girls will be distracted by these babies. <laughs> It's gonna look so girly. It's like <gasps> sweet jeans. Do you look at her boobs? No. No. Cause she's got them like pushed up in her hands right now. Or is just looking like I don't look at <laughs> just look at elsewhere. She's just like, why is this a thing? <laughs> See, and this is why I'm the common sense here, apparently. <clears throat> well, thank you, mom. Let's go find a place to gamble, and I go find the table that has blackjack against people with no cheating. I wish Florence looks at Carly for a moment before saying, really, I am not. Okay, yeah, yeah, I'm not at that age, so I agree to disagree. Agreed. 
Do I find such table? You do indeed find do such indeed table. Find such. T- it is over here. Okay. Is the um? Is the dealer a man or a woman? Woman. Okay. Hello, my good lass. Well, hello. Well, hello. What are the minimum? The minimum here is minimum only here five is gold. Only five gold. Well, slap my ass and deal me in. She slaps and I put her five ass. Gold on the... Oh, <laughs> <laughs> the table. What's that? What's that? Are there men? Yeah, one. Yeah, one. Did he? See... He did. He smiled. How do you feel? He smiled. So I sort of sit across from him, so he's like looking at me. Okay, okay. There you go. <clears throat> Ladies and gents, this is about to be the funniest five minutes ever. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna flip back to where I wrote down the rules for blackjack. And I'm just playing against him. I'm just against And I'm sitting here just being yogurt. Sorry. So you <laughs> sit down, you're ready to be yeah, dealed in. Dealed in. Mm-hmm. Hey, I'm just against What's that? What's that? Am I just playing against him or are there others? Uh there is him and then the dealer and then one lady. And then one lady. But the dealer is in play. Okay. How'd the lady react when the dealer slapped my? She went. Hmm. She went. Can I interpret what that meant? Kind of like a. Kind of hmm. like a. Hmm. An interest. Kind of almost kind interested, of almost but, interested but, sort of like, but sort of like. Sort of like. I can work with that. I can work with that. Can I get a drink? Sure, it'll be sure, a, if it'll I be in a, just a bit. What do you take? Bit, what do you take? Out of character, I would know what drinks straws, right? I mean, yeah, it's I mean, just me yeah, it's and all the classic, classic shit. shit. There are specialties there are too, special. but I mean, you know. Mm-hmm. How about I just need an a straw? Bit. You've got it. It'll be here in a while. Here in a while. Thank you. In the meantime, they uh they call for bets and say everyone who's in's in. I put five gold on. Guys, it's finally happening. An hour in, we're uh, two hours in. We're finally gambling. Yay! Yay! Alrighty, so you get, uh, you know, the uh, shuffles going, and and here's how they roll out. Give me a minute, because I gotta roll right down by by the cards. How does this work with the (laughs) three-way? What do you mean? What do you mean? (laughs) And this is out of character, um, because Carly would obviously know. Um, (sighs) But since there's three people, (coughs) who wins? Whoever gets closest to 21. <laughs> 21. <coughs> what you if it's a tie, then you have to. Tie, then you have to uh, actually, I'm not, actually, I don't remember. How do you break a tie in 21? There is a way. There is a way. Usually you're going against the Usually house, so like 21's an automatic win, but. Ah, if there's ah, a tie, it's a push. A tie, it's a push. What the fuck does that mean? That means no one wins. That means no. Do we get our bets back? Yes. Yes. Okay. So are you cool, ready cool, cool. for your so cards? You ready for your cards? I'm ready for my cards.
All right, so let's get right, our cards so going. Let's get our cards. <laughs> you're actually first, <laughs> you're up, actually on the deal. first up on the deal. Actually, no, you're second actually, on the no, deal. You're second. Sorry. So, so you get you get a queen. That's my face up card. Yep. Yep. And then you get get a five. A five. You're gonna have to keep track you're of these. Have to keep track of these. Yep. Uh, as for your uh, opponents, for your they opponent, have a six have and an six eight face and up. An eight. And the person in front of you is up. Front of you is up. So, so that would be the would be woman to your right. Before, um, before I look at my cards, would it be possible for them look, but kind of look like I'm looking? Wait, what are you trying Wait, to do? What are you trying to do? I'm kind of like faking looking at my cards when really I'm. Look when you're looking at what? When you're looking at what? Uh, I want to see them look at their cards. So you want to look at them so looking look at their at cards? Looking at their cards. Yeah, but make it seem like I'm looking at my cards. I mean, you can. That'll you can. take a little That'll deception, a I guess. Deception. So do I roll a deception roll? Yeah. Yeah. Or per, I guess, slide a hand. No, that's a deception because it's not like doing anything with your hand. Mm. But also, I, wait a minute. Don't Carly? Does Carly have proficiency in insight? I don't know. My little, know. my little Dion thing has a little half filled in. Yeah, so you're you're partially. Because what I'm thinking you could do, and this is just a suggestion, take it out of your life. In which you can try to incite them and see, get a an, an idea of what they're where they're sitting at. It wouldn't be it wouldn't be you know blandly looking at their cards. Well, I, th I was assuming I would do both deception first and then. Okay, right, all right. I'm just I'm just giving some options. You get what I mean? My deception roll was 17. Um, do I roll insight now? Uh, you can. Uh, you can. To try to see what try they got. See what they... My god. You guys. Hmm? I rolled a nat 20 on it. Oh shit. Uh, shit. you're pretty sure you're that pretty their sure face cut down cards face are a cards. jack and a king. Jack and a... So six jack, so eight six king. Jack, eight. I will wait to see what the other person does. Well, it's a, uh, oh yeah, it is their turn. Oh Sorry. Yeah, it is. Uh, uh, the man or woman have the jack? Or have the six? So the woman so has the, the woman six jack, the, the six man jack, has the, the king eight. Have... I look at my cards, and I kind of purse my lips a little bit. Just a little bit? Just a, Just a little bit. Almost like a tick. Like... But with my 17 deception. So your so deception your tip deception is working tip for is that. Working for th uh, the person in front uh, of you looks at their, cards, at their cards and they say they they're going to stay. They're going to stay. So the woman and then it's your turn. I I will hit. I have to hit. Nine. Is it face down or face up? Uh, they come in, uh, they I believe, in. when you do them like that, face up. Yeah. So, ten. Five. All and right. then you said a nine. Mm. Yeah. Don't say anything. 
Um, it's face up. You said. Yeah, that one's face yeah, up. That one's. Um, out of character question: If I hit over twenty-one, do I have to? Do I have to say I busted? Not in when not you're not in, versing the house. Versing you can house. bluff your way to a win. Your way to a win. So I have to get him to fold then. Pretty much. Pretty much. Right. Or to or make to... him hit. Okay, I I kind of smirk a little bit, like, keep a bit. And then I look at the man. I'm waiting. You gonna smirk and look at the man, huh? Just a little bit, like, not like I, almost like I can't control it. That's gonna be a performance check. Check. I'll performance... Yeah, yeah, I'm almost tempted I'm to let her have her deception, her deception from earlier because I don't feel like she was doing any deception earlier. Deception earlier. <laughs> it was also a 16, so that's pretty decent. So uh, he's gonna look and he's gonna say, "Raise five. Raise five. So the minimum's now up to ten. At which point the chick on the uh, first part. Uh, Chooses to hit for four, and she also raises up to ten. Hit for four, raised. She didn't raise; she, she just raise. matched. Sorry, matched. so she matched ten. She matched. And so far, the woman has a... A six, a jack, and a four. So I'm just boned. Six, a jack, and then a four. four. Yeah, and she's the, got the 20. Man, got... The man has 18. And she currently has, what, 25? Yeah, 20. Yeah. Four, 24. 25, 24, yeah. I have 24. <laughs> so I'm yeah. boned. Yeah, so she's low bullshit bluffing, which we already know she has the bullshit. She's good at this. She's just gonna have to do a really good roll and get him to fold. And she also has to take actions that would indicate that. Come on, Carly. I know you can mislead. Mislead them to death. You're not saying that out loud. You're not saying that out loud, are you? No. No. Okay. No, this is out of character. <laughs> Trust me, if this was Florence talking, it would be... You know. It would be like, you can't lie to save your soul. Um, so I put five It would be sticking to muddish. muddish. Yeah. I put five on the, um... On the table, and then I put down a five. Alrighty, do you want to Alrighty. accompany with that anything, that or...? Anything or... Uh, um, <laughs> my face-up cards are a nine and a five. No. Okay, you're not. You're not gonna try to. You're not gonna try to bluff and be like, "Oh man, I have such a good hand." Feel bad. Oh, I am, but just like I'm non-verbally doing that, but I like, I like kind of lean forward a little bit or lean back, kind of like eased, like she knows she has this game in the bag. In the bag. Okay, yeah, I like that one better. I lean back a little. I shake my hair out. And I smile like, gently at the man next. So you're gonna what? So you're gonna what? Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I put down the five to match their bet. And then I raised it another five, and then I lean back and smile at them. All right, do you want like, to roll a bluff or perception or whatever so deception? Be, so be, yeah, so that would be a deception for the bluff. Or maybe performance, because I'm performing a bluff. But also you're doing it in a misleading way. Because the reality is you... I, I, this is all out of character. I am not speaking in character. DM. Yes. Save us. Yes. Did you roll bad? Which Did you one? Roll bad? I don't no, know. No, I mean, I'm, am I, I rolling persuade, performance or, or deception? 
So for that one, for that one, it's I guess that's I more guess that's of a performance because you're really not you're really lying. Not you're not lying. speaking. You're not, you're not you know what not, I mean? Faking you know, anything? Fake, I guess you're guess just taking a motion of leaning motion back. back. And so much like an actor so doing, like it an actor doing it in a movie. Doing it in a movie where you're not actually you're not winning, actually but you're pretending to be winning as opposed to lying to about, lying I, won. about I, won. I won. I don't know. It could be either, honestly, be I, either, feel like. honestly I feel like. 26? Oh, shit. Shit. I rolled a 9. That's pretty good. Uh, they both uh, look... They both look... They my both look at, you, look at you. And they, uh... And they, uh... Let me make a roll. Oh, shit. They both fold. Yes! <laughs> yes! Oh god! So I, get, I get 20 extra gold? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes! Florence is just... Just kind of... Just kind of impressed. Impressed, like, watching... Impressed, mild in amazement. But... Holy crap, Bluffing. yes. Yes. You had no idea what I had, and you know what? I will. Oh say no, no, I did. I did the counting. It's just that I did not. That's why it was like. Yeah, Florence though would not know what I had. Oh, of course not. No, no, Florence does not know. So she just. She like, didn't even she's know. Just she's just nodding. like, oh shit, you won. Cool. Oh shit, you won. Cool. Yeah, she's so she because she's kind of nodding and like in a happy, impressed, a delight. So I mean, if I Florence was. Excel. What's that? What's that? Do I have to show what my cards are? No, that's no. part of winning. You only show your cards if you reveal at the drop. Reveal at the drop. Okay, I slide my. All right, so then uh, they so shuffle then, them up. Uh, they they say bets in. in. I put five gold on the table. So does everyone so else, does and they else deal out. Deal out, and you get. You get. Well, let's see what we get first. Okay. You get a six. And another six. And another six. <laughs> uh, the first yeah, person the looks, first at, person their looks hand at their hand and uh, says uh, hit. Can I get a feel for what they have? Oh yes, yeah, sorry, I forgot oh, to yeah, tell sorry, you their face-ups, which their are, face -ups, uh, they have a three uh, have a and a four face-up. So can the, she ins the can she inside the them? She can. She, she can, can try. Can try. I will. Ooh, that's uh, making up for my two good rolls with a one. Yeah, you think they have Yahtzee? <laughs> yeah. Are we blackjack anymore? I can't even know. I don't even know. Uh, does the man or the woman have the three? Uh, the, woman uh, the woman has the three, has and the she three. just hit and, and got a queen. And, and she is going she is to going uh, raise uh, ten. Raise. I look at my card. I look at my cards, and I lean back again. And I say hit. King. King. Fuck me running! I don't say that. <laughs> no, she does not, for no. God's sakes, if she better not. <laughs> okay. <sighs> What do you want to do? What do you want to do? I can fold now, right? Yeah. Yeah. I push my cards in. All right. You fold out, and fold the out. game continues, and the woman wins. She had exactly 21. Yeah, exactly. It's a good fold. It's a good fold. You only lost five gold. You only lost five gold. We only down five. I would have been down 15. Technically, you're, only up, you're 15. only up 15. That's okay. true. Yeah. 
In which Lawrence kind of kind of gives uh, Carly kind of like a high five. Like that's pretty good. good. Pretty good. I'm I'm surprising Florence with my gambling. Uh, yes. Bets in. Uh, bets in. I put five gold down. Do you want to bet, Florence? <laughs> and Florence kind of shakes her head like, Nah, I'm good. But I'm, you know, how I am these things. And these games tend to probably have, uh, probably you have to be kind of quick with on these things. You know, like I said. generally helps you not get kicked out of the t yeah. yeah, but still. Uh, but yeah, that says uh, bets yeah, in. It says bets in. Put five gold on Uh, you dealt your cards, uh, you, you see cards. that the woman gets a queen, gets a... that the man that, gets that a four, and you, get a, four and you get a three. And a five. And a five. I get a three and a four. And my three is face up. Yes. Yes. I always do face I up always first. Do face up. Okay. My notes for these for this gambling is just fucking wild. <laughs> I bet. I try to keep it kind of simple. Uh, but it comes uh, up, and it's actually and your it's turn actually first now. Turn. Ooh, fun! Um, I will do... Do I have to say hit first or raise first? You can do it on either end, actually. On... Okay. At this casino, I they're not following real rules. But it's, you know, I'll a fantasy hit. casino. Alright, you're, right, you're gonna hit. Alright, you're gonna hit. Seven. 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 So, fifteen. Yeah. I will I will raise five. Alright. Alright. The uh the uh the man, because it's his turn next, looks and looks. he actually because you he raised has to, he has to raise before he, he hits. Can I see what his reaction is to my Uh you can perception uh, check him, yes. Damn heroes using their heroes supernatural are... abilities to them. kill people at cards. Yeah. <clears throat> Dirty 20. Dirty 20. Uh, he looks... Uh, he looks... Uh, a kind of uh, nonplus. Kind of non not, not really either not way. Really more like he's way, still looking like at his own cards. cards. Cards look vibe check. Vibe check. Vibe. Can I vibe check their their heart their cards? Uh, I mean, you could try. I guess. Try, I guess. I mean, try to intuit their cards again. Their cards again. I will try their cards. <laughs> Don't fail me now, Don't psychic me powers. Now, psychic powers. Fourteen total. My psychic powers failed. So you look at them so and you're like, you you're, pretty you're, like sure you're pretty sure that they uh, they, uh, they, don't really they don't have anything good, really good, but that they're, they're, they're not in a bad spot a either. Bad spot. You don't know exactly what cards, though. Maybe a six and a four. Maybe four. a jack and a jack ten. And a ten. You don't know. Has he raised? He uh, he is going to, going to raise, to raise, and then he's gonna hit. I'm smiling. He hits for two. Right. He hits for oh, shit. He's going to pass. He's going to pass. Because he already raised, so he actually can. I smile at him. Smile to the 
Well, he. I swear uh, to God, if Wedge is gambling too. <laughs> in a way, in a uh, way but yeah. Uh, so he's but, yeah, not so really he's smiling, not really but he's smiling, he's all right. He's not he's looking right. too like, looking like unsure too now. Like, uh, and then the woman goes, and, and goes, she is uh, she is uh, going to raise, but raise, not hit, but not not raise, but she's going to match raise. and not hit. So it's still up to ten for you, and then it's your turn. But she stayed where she is. Yep. Sixteen. Bust it. Fuck it. Hit me. All right. All right. Two. Two. All right. I'll raise another five. Alrighty. Alrighty. So it's now up to 15. Up to 15. Uh, the guy looks uh, the guy and he's like, like... He's breathing in a bit. In a bit. And he calls for, he calls for the, match the match to, to the price to and then he hits. Price. You see he gets a 3. How's his reaction? He's pretty happy. He's pretty happy. He's not hiding it well. And then it's the woman's and turn. The woman's turn. And she also raises she and also hits. Ra hits. And she gets a five. She hits a five. She hits. Yep, she hit. He's busted. Did she raise or did she, she match the bet? She actually uh, didn't raise. She just matched. My bad. But she did hit, and she's sitting there, and she can't raise again after the first raise. one. So she has to raise before she hits. Is she um, looking unhappy? Uh, you got to do a perception uh, check on this one. He's hiding. Or intuition, I guess, but... You see her kind of like her. whisper fuck under her voice. Figured. So she so... Just, just have to deal with this man who probably. So what did I come back to with snacks and popcorn? Uh, the woman. Other than the woman, yeah. woman, yeah. The man probably has a twenty-one. Either a twenty or a twenty-one. I have uh, a 17. The question is, the question. are you going to hit or are you going to pass? Too you would have to get a friggin' low number. It's real silent. I'm going to my cards on time. Look, make eye contact with, smile, and raise the five. Gold. So you're raising five. Raising. Okay, so it's up to twenty now. Pots it. And what are you gonna do? I'm gonna stay. You're gonna stay. And I look at him and I say. Um, you cut out. I, I look. I was trying to whisper, but I. Oh. Said, I think I think you cut out again. Damn it! Ah. Okay, I'm gonna say it at full volume, but pretending I'm whispering it. Okay. Mm -hmm. I say you really, you really should be better at hiding your. Muscles. Did I cut out that time? No, you got it that no, time. It I was just I'm trying to think of what to say back. To say uh, back. Uh. He basically looks he down. Basically and he's like, down, hmm. He's like, hmm. And so he goes and he's, he, goes he hits and his thing and he's like, all right. And he's and like, he's, all right. He, he matches you. He matches. And he hits. It's a card. It's a two. It's his reaction. 
Is it gonna have to roll perception on this one? Perception or insight? Or insight. Or in because you're trying to read the person. Yep, see if he's lying. 18. Uh, I mean, he looks pretty uh, happy. He's pretty darn happy. Did the woman the woman's busted? As what is she? So it comes to her so turn, to her and turn. she uh yeah, she raises it raises ten gold, ten, but doesn't hit. Mm. But doesn't. I look at her. You've bested me this time, and I put my cards in. Because he had, I'm not gonna, say, I'm not gonna say this in character, but he had a face card. She busted out, so he has 21. She's busted. I would not be able to get him get another. I mean, it's up to you what you want to do. Oh, I already put my cards in. Oh well, you folded. Oh well, you. Folded. Or did you wait? What? I folded. Okay, is a good idea. So it goes to so it the, goes turn, to the turn, turn, and it's a, and it's, uh, a it's a pass. Uh, it's a pass. What happened? They both had twenty. Both had... What? Yep. They both had twenty. Yep. Yep. Bested me. Yeah, yeah. That, that was just that, totally that random just too. Totally I'm using random. a real card using deck real too. Card deck too. And just I like, wouldn't have won anyway. Like, you, no, but you wouldn't but have lost you your money because none of your money would have gone out of the pot. Actually, you still don't Actually, lose you your money. Don't. I think because there's oh, no house. There's no house. Cool, cool, cool. So I get to keep my money. Awesome. Yes. So no, no money lost that time. Money lost that. Speaking of, I, speaking of, I speaking of time speaking lost. Of, uh, I know uh, it's I getting know a bit late, and I don't want late. us to draw you too draw too you late. Too late. I'm actually not tired. As long as you're good, as as I'm as willing to keep good, going. Going. Yeah, I'm good. I mean, this. I, I made it so I start at 10:30. On. And plus, I think this is up Carly's alley, and she's just happy. She's riding that happy adrenaline rush. Yeah, I won that 20 gold in like my first round, and now I'm like adrenaline high. Oh god, yeah, I'm a gambler in real life. Ah! See? <laughs> see? And this is just, and as you're seeing, Boris is just probably, if she could, get popcorn and watch this shit. As you I mean, see the person controlling Carly in the background just having an existential crisis. Yep, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Because I do have addictive tendencies, you guys. I almost got addicted to Percocet. Oh. I've been addicted to a lot of things. See, it was funny because I had a kidney stone in January. Um, and they put me on Percocet. And I took my Percocet every day for, like, a solid, like, two or three weeks. Oh. Because I was in a lot of pain. And then I went to the urologist, and he wouldn't give me any more, and I got really mad. And I'm like, I got like, I got my emotional reaction, and I'm like, I had the sense of thought to be like, okay, maybe that's a good idea. He took away the perk. Yeah, that's, that's maybe a good idea. That's why when I had my <laughs> teeth taken or whatever, I did uh, weed instead. I when I got my wisdom teeth taken out, no no pain medicine i didn't even i took one pill the first day because my mom made me never took any more but then Madness. with the kidney stone it was like giving birth and so i'm just like i'm gonna go ahead and go on the percocet this time and i might not do it again i might just suck we'll see we'll find out if i ever get a kidney stone again knock on wood yeah let's Here's hope not. not yeah let's how about just yeah, try not to get a kidney stone not. maybe that's the number maybe one that's... concern before those other yeah, ones. Yeah, that's probably the best takeaway right now. <laughs> <laughs> While anyway. we're streaming and listening to reasons why. why. Yeah, I'm very open about my life. 
Um, anyway. So, didn't lose any money, even though I bet all of my winning. Meanwhile, what's happening with Wedge over there? That's a good question to ask. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. What if a, a Florence decides to poke him? To poke him. She will f do it. To be fair, she pokey him, not stabbing him, or anything of the lids of comes next. What happens when our dear Florence pokes our dear Wedge? Mm -hmm. So, are you ready for the next so, hand? For the next... Florence poked wedge. What? Nothing. Yeah, I know. I know. This is going to be fun to sit back and watch. Nothing. Apparently, no. Okay, next hand. Here it comes. Five gold. Sorry, I hit the mic. How dare. How dare. Mm -hmm. I've apologized. Uh Alrighty, so, Alrighty. so you, you receive, receive the eight and the, the ten. Eight. Ooh, nice. Uh, you see uh, that you the see woman that has a three has up, a and the man up. has an ace up. The man, is up, man is up first. Uh, he is going uh, to raise going ten to raise and stay. Ten. Quick question: Aces? Are they the? Is it eleven or one? Either, either. Mm -hmm. Aces wildish. So man mm -hmm. had the ace, and woman had a what? The woman had a three. The woman had a three. Raised. So there were 15 gold. I'm going to match. Once. So you're going to match. Match. Gonna match. Stay. Alrighty. And uh, the woman yeah. hits hits four or five and matches. Which makes it you went through yours, so then it's the man's turn again. He is going to raise five. Raise. So all I see is an ace on his side? Yep. And a five, if I remember correctly. The was for the woman. Oh, my bad. She has a three and a she five a visible. Do I have to? Do I have to decide whether or not to match or not, or I get my card? Yes. Yes. I make eye contact. I to it. With okay. Not with a seven. That's an eleven total. That's not gonna get it. Um. I'm gonna fold. I push my cards in. Do I drink here yet? Yes. yes. I say aloud. It is. I put a single gold on the tray. The the uh, the waitress says yeah. thank you. Thank you. Uh, the hand continues uh, for another round or two. We're bluffing, and the uh, the man wins with uh, nineteen. So I lost fifteen there. I'm still five up. It is good. No wait. Oh, and I no, think wait. you're even. That's now. not true. I'm even. Still. Still. So There's still time. 
Be ready for Mine's the next. Ready for the next. All right, ready for the next right, hand. For the next. Dealing in. Dealing in. So you got so a five and a six. A and a you six. see that the woman has an ace face up and the man has a king face up. Okay. Whose turn is it? It is actually uh, the woman's turn yeah. first, and she is going to raise 15 and pass. Pass up. Man's turn? Sorry, one more time. One more time. Hello. Guy's turn. Uh, I believe it's your uh, turn. But I have. I say all this aloud, by the way. Okay. You know this game. Okay. I, I say you know this. Keep going, but it's too rich for my blood. And I'm making direct eye contact with the woman. Okay. Kind of okay. like leaning forward a little bit, and so. <laughs> okay. Okay. So you fold. How does she? Oh, how does she react? Oh, she she, she, react? Looks, at you she looks at you and she blinks. <laughs> you're, you're not much of a conversationalist, I see. She, uh, she speaks she, uh, in, uh, she speaks in, uh, I believe it is... What did I have this person as? Okay, that's right. Uh, she speaks in Fae. Uh, which kind? Oh god, I gotta go look it up now. Let's see. Eh. Because it's either Sylph. Sylph. Yeah. I don't think it's Sylph, so it's the other one. Elvish? No. All right, no. then yeah, it's All Sylph. Because right. there should be more than two Fey languages, I think. It's either those or Undercommon. But that's generally if they're in the from the Underdark. I speak Sylvan. So Isn't what Drow she say? under Fey? Hmm. Is Drow under Drow. Fey? Drow? No, Drow is not Drow. a Fey. At least it shouldn't be. If they do count it as a failure, that's kind of. Well, I mean, they count. I mean, count. it depends because you have you have small fey like quicklings that are fey, but they speak under common for them quickly. Yeah. All right. I think it is Sylvan. I speak Sylvan. What does she say? She says, "says you suck at cards." <laughs> In Sylvan, I she... reply. In Sylvan, I reply. Yeah, you're not wrong. You still uh... not much of a conversation, Sylvan? No. <laughs> okay, I fold. Uh, the uh, betting goes for betting a goes round for or two, it. and they flip, and she has twenty-one. Good fold. Again. I frankly wonder why you don't insider, her, but I'm, I can see why that would be a little bit more difficult for our pay. They're known to be tricksters. Also, I think I'm actually really good, like, at guessing what other people have in Blackjack. I'm just not very good at playing the... Anyway, five gold. Five gold? Five gold? And Florence is just watching so this happen. So you get with an ace and a seven. Seven. Eighteen. And oh, nice. you see that there is a jack is with the man, or the woman, or the and woman. a two with the man. 
and you go first. You go first. Then the man, then the then woman, the then you. First bender, then first flexo, bender, then fry. Then flexo, then... <laughs> Hit me. With your best With shot. Your best shot. Hit you got a jack. With your best you got a jack. Shot. Ooh, a jack? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so you took it as eight. Eight. I will raise five gold. Okay, I just okay, want you to I... know that your ace is showing. Showing. And your jack is showing. Well then. Carly? Carly? Bullshit the living shit out of me. Wait, wait, wait. Ace is a 1 or a 10, right? It is. Ace I'm just making a... sure you know sure that you they, know. they, that's, that's the yeah, ones yeah. that show it. Okay, I got scared. I thought you meant like Ace was always 10. No, 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 like, no, 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 no. I'm just letting you know that that's what they see, so they're probably like, hmm. Which one does she actually use? Did she bust already? I, I, um played the game called bullshit carly that you're meant to play fucking you heck see, you see um you see carly just kind of kind of not really grimace because she's not actually grimacing but she makes it seem like she's grimacing but holding it back gotcha so performance gotcha. performance yes well yes well, i still feel like either feel of those like... could count because that's facial deception facial. yeah you're a facial deception. You're a facial destruction. Cool. Yeah, you I mean, right. See, that's why that's the hot. next stuff I want to do with us are just some dumb, us. stupid games stupid like games like I don't know, two truths and a lie shit for stream. Just cause. Dude, just cause. I would love two truths and a lie. I I feel like I, I feel win like too much I at that game. Much of... See, but that's fun because then we learn more about each. But also, it's a stream. <laughs> also true. Also true. All right. Having said that, uh, you uh, know, it's uh, now the next so person's the turn, next unless you're doing turn. something. No, it's just a twenty-five deception roll. So um, they think they they think I busted. They do. Uh, all right. So you see the guy hit. The guy hit, and he hits for a seven, and he raises five gold. Or sorry, he raised before that and then rolled the seven. So now it's at the ten. Ten. The woman is woman. going to raise. I already raised, raise. so it was already at ten. Oh, okay. So now it's fifteen, oh, okay. and then the woman raises again to raise. twenty. She hit. She did not hit. She did not. It's my turn. It's your turn. She's gonna do. Seven. Well, wait, wait, that's one. Currently at 18. Are you going to risk it all? It all? <clears throat> I... I look at my cards again. Keep that same grimacy expression but then very quickly look up at them and smile and have my little normal smile and then I match for for 15 more golden okay okay it's a bad idea and and, and are you gonna hit you gonna you pass gonna you gonna pass stay you gonna stay gonna stay all right all right with that in mind, the guy, mind, the uh, guy uh, after you goes after for a hit, goes and he a gets hit. a two. How's he looking? Feeling reactive? <laughs> he's uh, he's looking he's, pretty, uh, happy, he's pretty about happy about he's himself. Pretty smug. He's looking pretty smug. In fact, he in matched, fact, and uh, he didn't get a raise. He, he wasn't that confident, confident, but he does look pretty happy. The woman uh, uh, matches, but does not raise. bad call here so both of them didn't put any more money in no 
They yeah. matched up to what you did. Well, I matched up to what they did, really. It's true. So, yeah. Which means it should still be at 20. What's the woman look? She's looking happy, but a little happy, nervous little now nervous because the guy now. looks really happy. Guy looks really happy. And smug. Can I insight check to see if a smug is real? Sure. Forgetting. Um, that is a seventeen. I mean, he looks real confident. Real confident. He's real confident. I would like to make direct eye contact and just very delicate zip. And very delicately what? Very delicately what? Sip my drink from my straw. Okay. Okay. Leaning forward, you know, kind of. How's he looking? He. Or you mean he or oh, she? You mean he or she? He. he looks pretty confident. How's she looking? If I make direct eye contact with A bit annoyed. A bit annoyed. <sighs> well, I will just stay where I am. Alright. Alright. Cards flip. Cards flip. The woman has 20. Woman has 20. Fuck. I'm he out. has 21. Yes. I lost a lot. <laughs> <laughs> you're so just now getting, I'm what you're down just getting, to. The Sorry, fucked up ahead. part is you would have been tied up if you'd have hit. You got, got that too. Damn that he it. got. <laughs> Damn you. I am the card czar. I lost 20 there. You want to keep you losing here? Lose you lose could try here. another game. Try another game. Go buy a wedge Go some health. Wedge some health. Florence, my luck is. Don't look at me. I, I, I sat and watched, I mind my own business. I punched him, but he's. I'm actually not looking at you. I'm sort of looking in middle distance. Which Florence kind of pats on the shoulder and just said, "We just. I mean, you did wonderful. I mean, if it was a game of trivia, I I would have joined you, but it's not. You know. How about? Hmm. Another. Another what? Another game. Early. I wouldn't want to. Sp yeah, I wouldn't want to spend all my money in one place. Yeah, that, that that would be a one. Spend it at one place. Plus the people here. I think they're on to you. <laughs> Some of them don't like my. I and I get up and leave. I get up and leave. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, where are we headed? We'll where come we back. Headed? We'll come back. I want to go to a different game. What other games are available? I mean, what uh, games do you want to do? There's liars, do? liars, liars dice. Liars you've dice, got craps got and crap, a bunch of other stuff. I mean, this stuff. this I mean, one this has one basically has all the games. What's liars? So Liar's, so Liar's Dice, Dice is, is a game about, is a game about deception, deception and betting where you betting. Roll, roll five or six roll, dice or six that you dice keep hidden under your cup. Under cup. And you and say, say, I I think there are, think there ten, are ten fives on the table. On the and you put up a bet. Put up a bet. And someone else can, someone either, else can either raise bet. your bet. Raise your bet. Bet on a different on number, a different number, or challenge your or bet. Challenge at which point, bet, everyone has to reveal has their to dice. Their dice, and and whoever, whoever if the challenger, if was, the challenger right, was right, and they don't have they that don't many, or they don't have, have the, they don't have, uh, uh, I think it's not more than. Not so you more you than. can have less than, but not more than. than. So not say more. you're like, all right, there's right, a minimum right, of minimum ten fives on this. And it shows up, and there's shows only six there's fives, you six lose. Fives, you lose. But if there's if eleven there's fives, 11 you win. Five. And then the game proceeds then like the game. that. 
That's what they were playing in Pirates of the Caribbean. Yep. Ancient yep. gambling. Oh. Gambling. Oh. Yeah. How fun. Yeah. Super fun. Um, now here's my next question. Um, does stealing from patrons count as cheating? What? 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 I mean, no, but no. there's no stealing in the casino either. Oh, they don't allow stealing? <laughs> no. <laughs> they don't, they allow, don't stealing. allow stealing. <laughs> what happens if they what happens if they catch me? Uh depends uh, on what you stole. What you... And if you can pay it back. Pay it back. A sleight of hand is pretty good. I mean, go for it. <laughs> Got a good question, since there's all sorts of games here. Does there seem like there's be something that Florence would like? Uh, uh here? here? Uh, you do see a little table. A little table. It's a very small table, very but small it does table, look like there might be like something of interest to Florence. Mm -hmm. I'll follow Florence. What's, so what's the game? Oh, she's gonna kinda go look then. Curiosity. I'll follow. Oh, I just got the best idea. What? You continue first. So, Axel? So, so uh, this table, uh, you, this can table has you can see has a group, has of, a group of, small of small people telling each other riddles. Each other riddles. <sighs> okay, so she joins that game, I imagine. Most Why? certainly, ask, or at least most at least asked, what's the rules for this game? He says the rules are simple. The rules are simple. One person One asks person a riddle, the next person riddle, in the circle has to answer it and add five gold to the pot. The person who the loses, person who or the, are the, the last person the who last has person not missed has not an missed answer, missed. gets the pot. Gets the pot. Oh. I just came up um, with that one, by the way. That's actually really. Right? Doesn't that sound like a fun drinking game? Yeah. I. Does that sound like, sound like a fun drinking game? It sounds like kind of dying, dying. Yeah. Well, I mean, I you're will... you're out you're, once you're you out. fuck up. So fuck I up. mean. I will turn to Florence and I will say, uh, "Darling, might I borrow your chest?" Yeah, and Florence does loan her the chest. So I. Mean, I... I sit within earshot of them. Um, not without, or not outside of... Is this cheating or not cheating? What, what are you doing? Does, what, what are you doing? Does Bardic Inspiration... Would Bardic Inspiration help you? Uh, no, but... Uh, no, but actually, this section's combo, actually, so magic does work here. Magic. magic does work here, okay. Um, but in this game, Bardic Inspiration help her yes yes it would two, or i am correct no it is you are no, correct it, it would help her would help so the way this game so plays in game is i'm gonna game. ask riddles ask and riddle. you can either answer them in person or using your character's character. intelligence role intelligence. so it would help. yeah okay so i'm gonna sit uh not outside of 60 but still within earshot like comfortable ear i'm gonna open the chest I'm going to sit. I'm gonna. I'm gonna arrange my hair so I'm sort of like, sit like like. An indie music cover band. Of, or, I'm sorry, an indie music band's album cover. I'm gonna kind of sit like that with my lute in my lap, and I'm gonna just start playing and busking. The chest is open. And busking. And busking. I'm busking. <laughs> it's not a winning. It's not a winning, so they can't tax me. <laughs> it's an earning. It's an earning. I earned this money, so you can't tax it from me. <laughs> Tell that to the <laughs> government. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see. You. All right. And I'm All busking. Right. Are, are you joining are in? You joining Jewel? In? Yes. yes. All right, so it's a reminder right, so every a time reminder, you go around to pay around into the pot, you have to do five gold, gold each time. Gold. Of course. Alrighty, so All let's right. start so let's start simple, which they simple, usually which do to get the pot big. This is gonna be so difficult. Alright, simple, All right. simple. Simple, simple. 
I have branches, but no fruit, trunks or leaves. What am I? What am I? Uh, let me. So starting simple. Let's start uh, simple and see. You said has has. I have branches, I have branches, but no fruit, but no trunks, fruit, or, trunks leaves. or leaves. Sorry, not trunks, Sorry. trunk or leaves. What am I? What am I? Have no tr trunk, trunk. Have no trunk, but no leaves. No leaves. So I have branches. So I have branches. Have branches. But no fruit, but no trunks, fruit, or leaves. Or leaves. For for, for ease of ease. translation, we're just gonna post them into the uh, game chat. Yeah, cause Oop. yeah, because we'll, this we'll is say they come out me. as little pieces of paper. Yeah, and plus I'm here. Use... I'm hearing an echo. Hello. You can use your intelligence modifier for this, right? Yes. Okay. So Florence, you can int this out. Oh, of course. And, and, um, and... Carly is prepared to give you bardic inspiration, should you? Please don't need it in round one. Uh, of course. <laughs> That'd be an insult to the fact that she does have a 19. That'd be the biggest insult to make a character that don't know the answer to it. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna have to say a pink. A what? Kind of what? Bank. A bank? A yes. Bank? I was gonna say the government. Specifically a river Specifically bank. A river. But a bank. Ha! <laughs> so it goes around so it goes and around. one or two people drop out, people drop and, out. The and the next question, question comes. Question comes. This one's another easy one. I'm off. Oh, wait, yeah. I'm found in socks, scarves, socks, and mittens, scarves, and often and in the paws of playful paws. kittens. Adults. Carly. Know what it is? Yarn. Yarn. Good job. Good job. I'm just trying to make sure to see if it was me that was giving the echo. I thought it was a moth. No. Are people seeming interested in my playing? In my playing. Am I earning any coin? Well, you haven't actually, well, you rolled, haven't actually so. rolled, so. Oh, I gotta do that, don't I? <laughs> yeah, you have to roll performance. 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 Dirty 20. So, uh, you see a couple so, uh, people coming couple and people gathering, people around. gathering around. You're doing your amazing job. Anyone That's... loosening their gold? It's open chest right in front of me. Ooh, that's the next riddle. The next riddle. Up I go and light appears, and dark, light may appears dark, dark may come when the floor I'm near. Okay, I think I... This one's really easy. This one's really easy. Mm-hmm. Although I don't know if it's placed in the correct time period. Oh no, I don't think is electricity invented in this in this era. <laughs> this one's not this electricity, one's not but it because isn't the same era. Because if that era. was the case, then you have shocking grass. <laughs> Out of care too. It's I'm just gonna think. What What are your ideas, are your Carly? Ideas, since you're, Carly, busking? you're busking, my ideas are either curtains 
or a light switch. Either one of those. Good suggestions. What does uh, Florence what is, think? Uh, Florence think. Can she roll an intelligence on this one? Yeah. yeah. Because I just want to make sure this isn't getting too crazy. Look at me if you want bardic. Oh, that looks like a pretty good roll. Like You're good fine. Roll. So the answer so is probably answer blinds probably... or curtains. Yay! Yeah, and Florence does answer with that blinds or curtains. Alrighty, in this round nobody else drops nobody out, drops and they out. start increasing the difficulty of the riddle. What's the pot at? Currently, uh, probably, uh, about, probably like about like two hundred gold. Two hundred. Shit, Florence. <laughs> Big ring table. Is this a cheating table or no cheating table? Uh, this is an open table. We can cheat. I mean. I mean, she does have uh, she does have her familiar, but the familiar is kind of just chilling, not making she this cut. She also happen. has the bardic inspiration. That's why I went within. Yeah, no. Playing my lute, gently yeah. singing a song, so that whenever it's needed, I can give a help. Yeah, help me hand. Is anyone giving me money yet? Uh, uh, there are a couple people, are a couple people buy, but they're not buy, giving money not... yet. I play, I play even cooler. Ooh. A hard one. Oh no, I got it. Oh, damn. All right, Florence, with your 19 intelligence. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So at this point, one or two more people drop out, and so there's only about three people left besides Florence. You have bardic inspiration right now, I suggest. Okay. And which I would actually need to see what the heck is. Bardic inspiration is a 1d6. Just want to make sure. I'm singing it because I'm singing in real. I'm singing in game. Because I want to make clear that I want money. <laughs> <laughs> 19. 19 on that. <laughs> So you believe so that it's probably that it's fleas. Probably... Oh, yeah, yeah, I mean, it tracks, okay. Yeah, flea. So you're good. So Unfortunately, you're everybody good. else lasted you're that good. round as well. Yeah, she says safely. Wait, what happened? I bumped my mic, I'm so I apologize. No, 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 I heard Axel say something, but no one else left? Wait, some, I did yeah, someone else. Uh, nobody else uh, lost, nobody that round else lost that round yet. Oh. Yeah. Doug from the... I skipped Earth. Yes. I should have said lay, but lie lay. rhymes better. Yeah. I lie. Well, technically, some personification, I think lie would. Probably. No, uh, lie is still not the right still not. word. You never lie down, you, you always lie. lay down. Oh. 
Yeah. Well, since it's yeah. an object, it's not actually. Right. I'm saying that right, the word there is no word there lie is no that word means lie. lay down for people or objects. It's always really? past tense or past present tense lay present. down or laid oh. down. Laid. I thought you could say you lied down. Nope. Nope. English I misconception. I took a grammar class. I'm pretty sure. I took, pretty sure. I took a grammar class in college. I'm about 90% certain I'm wrong. Because I spent about 80% of that class arguing with the teacher. I don't respect grammar. Anyway, carry on. Apparently this is a 700-year-old English problem that I'm not ready to tackle. I was about to say. I went, I went and looked it up. I'm like, all right, it's like, and it's like, which one's correct? They're like, both. You, they've been arguing for 700 years. And at that point, I'm like, nope. I'm like, nope. Nope. No, I don't like you. to argue with like Twitch nerds who've, who've been arguing for like three months about like which streamer is the hottest. Is the hottest. I'm not arguing about I'm English. Arguing. English. That language doesn't that even language make, sense doesn't anyway. make sense anyway. Quick question: Can Florence get advantage from her familiar? Just by just you know. Uh, I guess uh, so. I guess so. I'm just asking because you know he's not. It's not. She's not ver verbally talking How to this. How good is Ursula at riddles? This riddles. I mean, just like whisper at Ursula. Like she's, she's just like caw. She's just like caw. But I'm a dragon. But I'm a dragon. <laughs> I mean, she has an average of ten. She has an intelligence of ten. So I think she's a little bit. I mean, it's, it's not that she's, I mean, dumb. That she's it's dumb. dumb. It's just like, can she help like, you with a riddle? the riddle? If the answer is yes, the then yes. I mean, she could spitball with Florence. It's true. In her brain. It's true. In her brain. Yeah. All right, go for it. All right, go roll, for roll it with advantage. Roll, roll it with advantage. You're welcome. You're, you're over. You're you might want that bardic inspiration, inspiration too. Oh yeah, you definitely get that bardic inspiration because that's all I'm good for in this gambling. All right, so <laughs> you th you think think that it's it, that it's, it's talking about a writing about implement. A writing a writing implement. Mm. I'm, I'm just thinking this over. Because you said there's a writing implement, right? Yes. Hmm. Impent or impint? In what? In what? I heard imp something. Impent? Impent? I, I don't think I even know what that means. I don't know. What did you say? You said writing something. Implement. 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 Oh, implement. implement. I was like, impent? I was like, impent? I'm going to have to go pick yeah, up so another like dictionary. Like another dictionary. <laughs> Back in school? Yeah, it's Holy like a shit. pen or a pencil Holy or something. It's just, hard, man. Yeah, yeah. Michael, you want to help him out? What's the thing? What do I have? How about I? I guess not. I guess not. <laughs> I know. <what. laughs> He's like, what are we doing again? What are we doing again? Are you talking about that thing that she can't figure out? Figure out. Yeah, that's the thing they yeah, can't figure thing. out. I'm a dumb person. <sighs> to, be fair, to be fair, I may have changed may the wording have changed of this one so you could look it up online. online. Oh, why do you think I would look it up? <laughs> I did not even consider cheating in this game. Shoot, no. no. I didn't look it up either. You're assuming I, I looked it up. Sorry. He wanted Sorry. to prevent that. It's easy to prevent what? it. Just a little bit of changing of the wording. So easy. So easy. Yeah. I mean, really, do you think I'm that type of person to do that? <gasps> I mean, jeez, you're making it sound like you're fine when you even die. Don't come to Earth. Okay. Tree. No, that's the problem. 
only I figure about 20 or 30 Speaking of, I Speaking also of, wanted to I put extra pressure on the situation by saying that you're the last one left in the pot left if you win this. Oh, God. Son of a bitch. Uh, <laughs> you are horrible now. This is horrible. <laughs> Fucking heck. What the heck? Uh, I'm a bad person. Bad person. Yes, you are horrible. That's all right. You guys love That's me. Right. You guys love me. Yeah. Yeah, sure, sure, sure. Ah, uh, come on. Ah, uh, come on. Just, just join us for join some us Among Us. Jewel will have Jewel great will time. Have great time. See, there's a reason why I don't trust you. And I would absolutely love to play Among. Well, I don't know when you guys are free, but. And it's a rainy implement. Yes. I don't know. I, don't know. I, I can't figure out that one. So dug from the earth, dug from the earth, and the tree my skin birth. Skin birth. Yes, every day I lie on your earth. On your earth, not hearth. Sorry, hearth. I always saying it wrong. Always saying it wrong. I always saying it wrong. Saying it wrong. I mean, I thought it was charcoal initially, but it's not. That doesn't make sense. And the. And this is supposed to be a riddle. Right? Yep. Yep. I know, I know. I, I'm just making to be, it. To be fair, I to made up fair, a couple of the riddles in this one, but most of them I just reworded just or copied. Reworded. So, like, the so like the, the curtains one the curtains and the one. flea one is me. You can tell because they suck. <laughs> nah, and, they don't. And then these Buddy. ones are re rewordings. Re I probably ch changed like two or three words, I think. Okay. okay. This. And you say cheating is allowed here. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So Googling would be cheating. I mean, yeah. I mean, it's. Yeah. It's, you might find this one, find this even, one with my even with my rework. I did not find the riddle. I googled writing implement and looked at synonyms. Okay. And I came up with a crumbly, porous type of coal resembling wood, charcoal, used in drawing. That's one writing That's... implement. It's called... Zan? Is it what? It mentioned. It's called Fusan. Interesting. I know. Oh, this one's really hard, you guys. Yep, and yep. Florence decided to pick the hardest freaking game. Get good. Get good. To be fair, it's got the to big fair, payout. The big payout. The pot's probably like four or five hundred like gold. I'm gonna go with charcoal. Yeah. Fuck it. Fuck it. I'm going with charcoal. Oh. You're going with charcoal? Yeah. With charcoal? Mm hmm. Uh. Because the the so, guy behind the you, guy behind you laughs, laughs, and uh, the moderator says, the moderator says no, "No, we go no, to a final we'll round." A final round. Okay, wait, wait. So Florence is out now, right? No, she no. was going to she win if she had done that. If she had done that, so it's kind of like the last. Like the last when you're down to the two, you down have to, two, to do have to do a double. A double. Right? So she had right, won, so the other guy missed, and if she had missed, won again, won again, she would have won. She won. Now they have to do now it again until it again someone until gets a double. Someone... So um, Florence automatically is going to get bardic inspiration no matter what she rolls. The other guy is going to get cutting words. 
<laughs> All right, good to know. Uh, good to know uh, great. Great. Oh, heck. Oh, heck. Two uses of bardic inspiration. And continue. Oh, heck. Let's see. Is that supposed to be is blue? Yeah, sorry. Yeah. That's the rest of it, or is it more? Uh, there's one more line. It's done in the old lyric style. Lyric style. But cut off. Has bardic I know, I know. I know, I'm just I'm thinking this one. Um. How much bardic inspiration are you coming for? So that's twenty-three. All right, you're pretty sure it's grass. Pretty sure, it's grass. And she does it. Grass. Grass. All right, and the other guy got cutting words down, so Florence wins the pot. Wait a minute. Hey. Wait a minute. Cutting words, but the thing about cutting words is, does it affect? Yeah. No, but it's awful hard no, to concentrate hard. when you're doing, when you're being mocked when you're being mocked. with the savage victory <laughs> of a real bard. <laughs> well, hey, cutting words would affect it because it's a it's a, an attack roll ability check or a damage roll. So it's an it's ability check. Is the in is the in, in? Yeah, 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 it is. It is. It is. Yeah. I just wanted to make sure because I didn't. I, I just wanted to make sure it was straight. It was you know a straight. Nope. Yeah. Just so I win. We all Lawrence win. inadvertently wins. <laughs> you, you you win because you have to get that. But like, I also cutting words to him, and he doesn't. He didn't even know. He looks at you. He looks at. He looks at me. What does he look at me for? I'm just here busking. Filthy buskers. <laughs> oh, he, he doesn't like the poor. I see. He doesn't like the poor whore. The Ooh. There's no good way There's to combine no... that. That has the same ending. It has the poor whore. Poor whore. Poor whore. The poor. The poor. Uh. <laughs> Hashtag Michael. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> so Florence won, like, how much money? 